We'll do it live. Okay. We'll, no. we'll do it live. Fuck it. Do it live. I can. I'll write it and we'll do it live. I love it. Definitely a solid, solid story. What's up, everybody? How you guys doing? Let's go ahead. Let's get this rolling. It is Monday, so we do have another Madhouse out here for you guys today. So make sure you guys are hitting that like button, shout out. There's always room for another lunatic at the Madhouse. You guys know the way that we do things around here. Appreciate everybody showing up. And uh, as people are rolling off of the nine to fives, we are going to get things rolling. I know I normally burn a little bit of time. I get through the rules, get through all that good stuff before we jump into the auction. But in the meantime, make sure you guys are getting to go in the chat. Let us know what you guys are looking for today. And also, say what's up. Communicate, man. Say what's going on, man. I know you guys had a long day at work, so I mean, let's have some fun tonight, man. All right, we got GT Key Comic. What's going on, man? How you doing? We got PSK in the house. James Pemisitor. I I know you told me how to say it before. It's gonna take me a minute. I suck. Sorry, man. We got David Brewer. How you doing, man? We also got uh Kenneth Bird in the house. I'll go through and. Say what's up to everybody as they roll in, but just want to give you guys the early birds a little shout out. And of course, a big thank you to all of our supporting patrons. Uh, do want to let you guys know, man, you guys are all awesome. Everybody that has joined the uh, Patreon, man, you make it so we can do what we do. You know what I mean? And you guys are also going to get a little bit of something on the side. We are bringing back the shenanigans prints, the art prints, the exclusive. So you guys will be getting that quarterly. So the way that it's going to work is every month I'm going to be showing you some. Uh, details let you guys know where that's coming where that's at where uh it's gonna be uh what it's gonna be i mean so you guys can see what kind of homage it is and all that good stuff so uh if you guys want to join in on the patreon you guys will get exclusive rights to so go ahead and get your shenanigans print uh in about three months so oh every quarter i suck at it so what would that be june something like that so make sure you guys are joining and uh, you guys also get the member giveaway on the wheel that we do every month that is going to be on the next show. So I'll make sure you guys have two giveaways that are coming up. So stay tuned for that. Appreciate every single one of you guys. Let's go ahead and let's jump on into the rules so we can go ahead and jump right into the show. So each round, each round per seller is going to be four minutes maximum. We're going to go ahead and give the sellers four minutes. Go ahead and do whatever they're going to do. Bins, claims, pulls, all of that good stuff. As soon as the auction item is dropped, then the timer will go to two minutes, and 30 seconds. If the seller no longer has two minutes and 30 seconds in their four-minute slot, then we're going to go ahead and start with whatever time is remaining. Remember, we do 30-second overtime here. If you guys engage in the action during the 30-second overtime, there and something that we are going to be uh, pushing forward and making sure that we do to make sure that there's a little more time on the clock. You guys have full, fair opportunity to go ahead and get these books. If there are multiple active bidders uh, and there's people that are bidding, you know, maybe we, there's different lag advantages. So, if I see multiple active bidders in an auction, I will trigger that automatic 30 seconds. That is the last chance to go ahead and get in on these books. Once I see that there is a fold or an end line, then bids are done. That's the way that it's going to work. So make sure you guys are paying attention to that. Any bids in the last 30 seconds will trigger an automatic 30-second restart. If you guys are jumping in and you guys are trying to snipe those books, it does not exist here. It does not happen here. So make sure you guys are jumping in where you guys can. And taking advantage of the 30-second uh, overtime, man. You guys want to make sure you guys are getting those books before they're gone. 
Sellers can only claim bin or participate in pools after the auction round is over. They can, however, put their reserves in the chat. I will recognize those if there is anything that is remaining at the end of the round. Sellers can also only join in auctions if given permission by the highest active bidder. Remember that the chat in the community always comes first. In this case, panel members are here to offer books to the community. Great deals, great prices, but also you guys need to make sure you guys are communicating with the sellers because if you guys don't, the sellers are, are uh, actually uh, interested in the books, then they're going to go ahead and jump in and take those books home and make sure that they get a good home in that go in one of those short boxes. Claims over the microphone will not be accepted due to lag advantage for the panel members. The reason we do this, we want to make sure that you guys have a fair opportunity to go ahead and get these books. However, you might get them. So we just ask that the panel members, if you guys are jumping in, use a different device other than what you are streaming on. Also, buyer chat rules, wait for the start line to go ahead and place your bid. Please allow the seller time to go ahead and show their auction before you guys start jumping in on the action. The, uh, the start line and the end line, they're pretty much king. That's the way it works. So if you guys start jumping in on stuff, you guys see a start line, uh, that is perfect opportunity for you guys to go ahead and do so. If you guys see a start line that is dropped, know that the timer will go ahead and start in an orderly fashion. If the seller is giving a full description, whatever the book is, then we'll kind of give them a little bit of time to go ahead and get their gallop, let you guys, let you guys know what you guys are bidding on. Also, uh, before the start line does drop, it's a perfect opportunity for you guys to ask if you guys can do payment plans, if you guys have any questions about the books, if you guys have anything in general you guys want to ask any of the panel members. Maybe uh, what color underwear is Cat60 wearing today? People want to know. None. Oh. None. <laughs> oh, man. But, hey, you can ask all before the start line. So make sure you guys are jumping in. Claims the bins can be placed at any time by the chat. So first come, first serve policy. If you guys see something you guys like, drop your claim. That's the way that it works. First one to go ahead and place a claim by the chat will be recognized as the winner. One claim per line. Uh so make sure that you guys are jumping in. Multiple claims to the single line will only have the first claim recognized. Claim all is the only acceptable alternative to claim in the single line. So make sure you guys are jumping in there. Get those claims going. Make it happen. Buyers are expected to pay for all winnings within 24 hours. If you guys are picking up the books, make sure you guys are reaching out to the sellers. Make sure you guys are making sure you guys are doing good on your end because the sellers are going to make sure they pack up those boxes nice and tight. They get it going for you. And uh, you guys get some awesome stuff in the mail. That's the way that it's going to work, man. Uh, remember, uh, it may be easy for you to purchase. It does come out of the expense of each seller's time, the dedication, all of that stuff to go ahead and bring those books. They got to go out there. They got to find them. They got to bring them here. Deals have to come in for deals to be made. So that's the way that it's got to work. Make sure you guys are beating them halfway. Sellers do have the right to refuse any bids from an active bidder with an outstanding balance. They can put these books back up for sale following a 24-hour notice. Make sure you guys are following up and meeting your obligations, man. Don't be that guy over there in the corner that just says, I bought a book. I don't know. Oh, man. I totally did. Yeah, don't be that guy. So make sure drama, bullying, harassment, trolling, mistreatment, and or general a-holery towards other lunatics will not be tolerated. We don't take this lightly. If you guys aren't being cool in the chat, you guys are harassing in one way or another, just decide that, hey, man, I'm going to be a funny guy and start saying some stuff that's offensive to somebody else. Well, leave that to us, man. We can defend each other up here. Uh, yeah, if we're joking and everything and you guys see something in the chat that is going on, uh, I understand that, uh, hey, we're here to make sure that you guys have a good time and we're all joking around, but make sure you guys are being lighthearted out there. And uh, Bad House Collective is not condone any verbal abuse whatsoever, so please leave the politics, the drama, and the issues at the door. Moderators will not hesitate to ban anyone who refuses to be an excellent member of the community. Just be great to each other and people on the panel. We're all here to have a good time, not here to deal with more BS. Just saying, man, someone will get drop kicked. It's going to happen. All right, man. So let's go ahead and join... Uh, Hold on. Let me see. There it is. I wanted to make sure my lineup was all good to go. So let's go ahead and get our panel introduced. Starting off with this guy. Let's get it going. What's up, man? Hi. How you doing? What's going on, everybody? Uh, on for the the what is up with you? Is, is your mic what, under a pillow? Was the sound crappy? Now now I can hear you. Shit. Wait, hold on. Let me, well, I'll You're fix good. it in the You're app. good. I can hear you. I can hear you now. Yeah. Anyway, uh, yeah, what's up, everybody? Uh, came in uh, short notice, so I figured I'd do a $2 pull box. Uh, I was actually up 
pretty late last night putting this box together figured i'd do it wednesday but screw it here monday so have at it uh got a great panel tonight as usual and we got some cool new things going on here at the madhouse so come on through hang out with us and let's go all right man there'll be some awesome stuff coming through man make sure you guys are getting ready for that two dollar pull box a little bit of maddie on the screen for you guys i don't think your pixels on the tv have ever looked this great just go ahead and say that so hey man someone's gotta do it so we'll see you in the first round my dude we'll catch you then all righty all right man we got a little bit of maddie freeze in the madhouse coming in here on a monday so make sure you guys hit that like button share it out there's always room for another lunatic in the madhouse and i will give some shout outs after the uh panel uh gets done with their intro so make sure you guys are saying what's up in the chat i'll go ahead and address you accordingly let's go ahead and let's jump on into the next lunatic over here this guy does not play he's got a whole bunch of crazy books to go with it so make sure you guys are taking full advantage of it let's get it going Oh, my bad. Sorry, didn't realize you guys were here. I was just reading my X Men 121 signed by Chris Claremont. Hello, Hello. everybody. <laughs> Looking forward to wheeling and dealing. I got uh, five boxes of mystery sitting right. Where is it? Right here. If you want in, you let me know. We're going to have fun. Usual shenanigans. By the way, it's an East Coast show tonight. You'll notice everybody on the panels on the East Coast. The only one who's on the West Coast is the host. West hey, Coast man. Host. I'm holding it down over here. Someone's <laughs> got to do it. Just saying. Yeah. Well, all right, man. Well, hey, Zarabinsky, right. I know you got a whole bunch of crazy deals. Can't wait to see him on the first round. We will see you then, my man. We'll catch you, catch you. All right. All right. Let's go ahead. Let's keep it rolling, man. Let's go ahead and introduce our next panelist. <laughs> here we go, man. Oh, and here's your host. He's a good guy. Johnny Vincente. Welcome to Oh! <laughs> Game show, five guys from New Jersey, four guys from New Jersey. Guys, how you doing? Hey, how you doing? How you doing? How you doing? <laughs> my, my people, yeah, my people. Oh, Ow. man. Oh! Oh! All right, man, what are we doing? Uh, so I got auctions. I do have a pool box. It's not, like, close to me, so, like, don't do those the first round. But after that, we'll talk about it. I got to move it um what else we got man i got some cool builders i got a lot of iron man i got fantastic four i got a lot of cool stuff and then the giveaway buyers giveaway you're gonna get to choose man so this is witchblade volume one. Oh, oh, oh! Um, demon wars the demon spirit this is a really really famous uh fantasy writer if you don't know uh, and then maybe you don't like fantasy type stuff so i got this uh honor protect sir beat and burn the police doing what they do there you go so you can choose uh whichever one of those you want that's the buyer's giveaway yo and then you guys know me man i do little giveaways every single round so yeah man make sure you guys are taking advantage of that and getting in get something nice all the way from jersey man so get in there the big black couch and the man on it back in the madhouse jesus All right man <laughs> play the plays a jesus video oh mm -hmm. man i was wondering where the hell that was from man i was like what the shit? oh you haven't you haven't seen the jesus video it's so i've good. seen it i've seen it lurking in the background let me see where where the hell is it it's, at oh look it so good he's just <laughs> jesus look at there's just a chaz up there on the corner let me see what i can find oh hold up before we go i'm gonna find the jesus man oh yeah there it is hey scotty Jesus, man. The music. Oh, my God. So good. That piano. It's so good. good. <laughs> I love oh, everything so about good. that video. The guy's stupid hair, everything. Uh, love it, man. That's pure so 90s, good. and it's terrible. All right, man. <laughs> yeah. We'll see you on the first round, man. We'll catch you then. All right. Man, Jesus. Let's go ahead and let's head on over to next seller. Oh, man. Get ready, guys. We got this guy coming in. Let's do it. You grab my ass. 
No. Do you want to? No. Sh sh should I? <laughs> okay, continue. There you go, man. Cat 60's uh, first cover appearance. They, Showing they up right there. Identity. Yeah, man. Well, fucking LifeLock didn't even pick that shit up. Son of a bitch. Yeah, so. So they say we're all East Coast, right? But I identify as a Saskatchewanian. So. <laughs> I don't know what the fuck time that is, but. I'm from Saskatchewan. Oh, my God. <laughs> that guy died, too. That sucks. Looks like he fucking had a ton of steroids, dude. He's yeah, that's that's true. Probably chugging them down with energy drinks too. That's probably not good. So, anyways, I, I started a new job. Um, I may, I might be calling you someday soon. You know, I'm I, I can get you loans up to two hundred and fifty thousand dollars. Seriously, just call, or I'll call you. <laughs> We'll make it happen. Oh man, all right, cat. We'll catch you on the first round with your uh, your loan sales and some books, probably. So. We'll catch you then, man. Well, already. My God, man. Deuces. And by the way, man, if you guys didn't know, man, we, that is Cat 60's first appearance on uh, Comic Books. So make sure you guys go and pick that up. Spawn 340. He'll even probably sign it for you. So get it going. All right. Let's go ahead and let's jump right into the auction format right after I get some shout outs. Let's get it going, man. Make sure you guys are hitting that like button. You know what we do, man. I'm going to pick it up where we left off. I've seen some people topping in, man. You got David Anderson. What is going on, my dude? I see Richard Johnson. How you doing, my dude? We got David Reese. What's going on? Mr. Collector, man. Sharpest hair in the game. I don't care what anybody says, man. Looking fresh, man. You probably still sporting that Aquanet or something, man. Because it's nice and... Dude, it's nice and... Nice and... Oh, yeah. Did like, you say Aquanet? Yeah, man, he's busting out that Aquanet. Uh, <laughs> see, we got Nate in the house, of course, man. You saw him in this big black couch. What's up? Uh, let's see. How come SpaceX ships blow up on the return trip? Is it because Earth is flat? Yeah, man. The, the trajectory is all wrong. Just saying. What's up, Weapon X? How you doing, man? Hot mustard gas. What's going on, my dude? Hope everything is well. All right. Let's go ahead. Let's get it going, man. You guys know the way that we do things over into the auction format. So let's go ahead and let's get her going. Starting off with the first round. That's going to be Maddie Freeze. What's up, man? Yo, look at this background. Look at it go. Look at oh, that. Oh, God. <laughs> no, that's insane. It's so sick. Look at that. Look at these effects that we got going. Oh, So, man. anyway, I got a uh, buyer giveaway is going to be two books. You will get Winter Soldier. That is the trade paperback. We need a complete collection by Geis Lark. Yeah, I said it. So, there it is. You get that. And then on top of that, I'm also going to put in the cosmic ghost rider trade paperback so you get the whole story of all that no spoilers you know there's a character from the past who supposedly well not supposedly is cosmic ghost rider so both of those are the buyer giveaway cosmic ghost rider and winter soldier and trade who is the cosmic ghost rider there maddie frank somebody <laughs> see no spoiler let the person read it and be like oh, i had no idea it's Castle. We see. So uh, tonight I am just going to be doing a two dollar pull box. Wait here. There you go. Two dollar pull box. So <laughs> damn Nicholas Cage on there. <laughs> just let me know what you want. I re put a bunch of new books in here. Uh, there are some books in here that are honestly not two dollars. A lot of keys. I got some. Female covers in there, bronze, silver, crazy shit. So, start it up, have at it, take some pulls, and let's get this going. All right, man. You guys got two dollar pulls. Make sure you guys are jumping in there, having some fun with it, getting it going, man. man yeah, I put a bunch of other stuff in there, so hopefully you guys enjoy it. And females, you know, just people in general. Dude, this, this background music makes me want to get on my Robocop outfit and just start fighting crime. I'm all about it. It's so weird. I don't hear it. Like, I hear it, but it's very, very, very low on my end. I don't want it to be too loud because yeah. then it just gets distracting, and then I'm just not going to pay attention to any of the auction. That's going to be chair dancing all night. It's going to happen. <laughs> all right, so man. I, got... I won't pull anything just to show you guys, but you could take ah. the Matty Freeze word. It is stacked. 
There you go, man. Hey, do you actually know anybody in Jersey that talks like that? Uh, no. Guys that work no? at gas stations? I mean, you might hear it from, like, an older kind of guy, but, like, we don't really, like, go with each other and be like, hey, whoa, what are you, what are you, what are you like, <laughs> Hey, just, the got a goo. There you go, PSK wants 10 PSK pulls, with man. 10. Always random. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Eight, nine, four, ten. seven. Right, let's see. Let's put these things in order. That I think which is the coolest. The coolest. You gonna put Ooh. the coolest first? I could. I would. I would make that the spoiler. Yeah, I'll make it the last. Well, I don't know. I think they're all cool, but that's just me. So, uh, let's go through it. Uh, I will get more lighting actually after this. But you got this is like that book. Is this is the <laughs> you know with this the thing like, and the pages and yeah and actually it's pretty cool comes with like the card on. comes with the card son they go oh you so, got the card man dude i was at my lcs i was fighting people for those so that's in there you got rom number two haha -ha. one of the variants haha -ha. no it's haha -ha. That was a key. I forgot what it was, but it was the, I think, first appearance of this chick. Uh, totally Steve? awesome Hulk. It could be Steve. Maybe that little guy is Steve. That's in there. Then you got Chrissy Zulu, Miles Morales, Spider-Man, the cat variant. Then you got <laughs> Kaza, the number 10 Kaza. Then, I don't know if that's a key. It could be. I think it is i've seen that cover before but that is x-men number 154. isn't that cyclops dead Could be. that's a key and then this is a key first appearance of the hermit and then first appearance there it is first appearance of jonathan own later becomes spot in a newsstand that's uh we're in uh into the spider-verse then 15 dollar book oh. that was the variant of dark knight death metal number one uh, one in one in twenty five variant by Doug Maki, and then Arachnophobia. I had another oh, one. God. Threw it in there. Arachnophobia, the trade. Well, actually, that's another little thicky. Little beep up. Let me fix it. <laughs> square bound. <laughs> square bound. So you got two square bounds in there. So you are crazy. And then that's also putting you on the pulley for these two. See, they go crazy. Man. What? There you go. Get in there, man. That is two dollars a pull. So make sure you guys are jumping in. Awesome stuff in that box. Maddie will pull it out for you. Thank Maddie, you. Maddie's hating comic books tonight. I may hate comic books tonight too. <laughs> Every night, I actually want to want to be blown away. I actually read this. You could True read. Story. Yeah, I, I actually read, read this one. This is this was read like read by me. I'll tell you right now, I was not happy with the ending, but I did read this. As far as blown away, I could do I could do without the away. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, I can't. I, I don't want to do any like. I already have like the back end joke, so I can't do that one too. <laughs> back end jokes. Come on, <laughs> we're talking anus. Oh man! <laughs> All right, guys, we got two minutes on the clock. Plenty of time for you guys to go ahead and get in on this pull box. That is two dollars a pull, man. Go ahead, pull, tug at it, and get in there, shoulder. jump on it. Do it. Yeah, like want. I said, it's there's a lot more in here. I know I put a lot more. Like there's like a thirty-five dollar pull in there, a couple twenties, and they're all two bucks. So, I mean, no matter what, you're making your money back. And if I don't like what I get you, and you don't get one of the pulls in your ten or five or whatever, I'll go and pull another one just so I think you get your value. Because I'm a crazy yeah, boy. There you go. You guys will go ahead. You guys can get something nice, man. Just go ahead and jump in there. Make sure you guys are taking advantage of Maddie. Just, I don't know what the, he's been sniffing paint this morning or something, putting that pull box yeah, Take advantage of Maddie. What, what kind of show is yep. this? Take advantage of Maddie. That's a whole lot of advantage to be taken. So get it. Do it. <laughs> you got a minute on the clock. Uh, Zabrinsky, don't want pulls. The same one up. <laughs> Did you see that in the chat? 
Oh, yeah. Look at Zarabinsky jumping in. That's uh, two spots so far, man. So uh, Zarabinsky said Super Chat goes in for goodies, man. So if you guys want to jump in, uh, reminder, if you guys donate to the Super Chat, um, every $5 is going to go ahead and go towards a piece of swag or whatever you want on the Madhouse store that includes hoodies. Uh, there's metal prints. There's a whole bunch of stuff, man. Just five bucks to go ahead and get you in on that wheel. Have some fun with it, man. Do appreciate every single one of you crazy bastards, man. That's what's up. I'm pretty right. sure my brother read this one. I have no idea, but I don't know. Reading is tough in the Frizo household. More for me, though. <laughs> oh, man. You, you know, you. I'm just going to stop. <laughs> <laughs> So yeah, it's 50 seconds left again. I know it's boring to a degree, but there is bangers in here, like I said. So I'm not going to sit here and be like, oh, please. But you'll be happy with what you get, I'm pretty sure. So next round, I'll be doing the same shit. So come hang out and make You're some You're doing the same shit, man. Hey, man, you guys have opportunity to go ahead and get in on this box. Just telling you, man, don't be like this guy. Go ahead and jump in there. Get something nice, man, because there's a whole lot of books that are in there for you to go ahead and get. I'm trying to find True. the damn video. I can't I'm find waiting. it. I'm like, I tried, man. I can't find it. All right. I'm just playing a random one. Here you go, man. Oh, geez. I can't even find the other one. I was going to click. We need to clean this. Go to the top. Out. You'll find something. This is this is terrible. What is this? Why Taylor Swift keeps coming up in controversy? She's a nice girl. I would patty her cake. There you go. You Okay. Dang. That works. <laughs> All right, man. Patty we'll, cake. We'll see you on the next one. Let's go ahead. Let's head on over to Zarabinsky. What's going on? Man? <laughs> All right. Um, to the right of me, which is your left, I think. Those boxes right there. There's five bo mystery boxes filled with wonder. Uh, I was pretty transparent with what slabs are in there. If you were following IG at all, if you weren't, it behooves you to hop on IG, look at my profile, and see what slabs are in those damn things. It would make you crap your 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 what are they called? Bridges? Yeah, crap your bridges. Your bridges, I, man. And I've been throwing in rows periodically as I've been sitting here. Um, so uh, what I'm going to do, and this is for um, fans of uh, of the 80s. So if you weren't born in the 80s, you probably don't know what the F this is. But if you are a collector, you're going to know exactly what it is. And you're going to be like, I'm out of my freaking board. We're going to start the bidding off at... $30. And this also can be for a reseller too. All right, ready? Let me let me just put them in numerical order. Yeah, Which one is this? Thing, man. I won't start that number until we see all the bids. Uh, nine, eight. And also, uh, Frank Miller did the uh, illustration on the first, I think, seven issues. Um, but these are the only ones I have on me at this particular time. I don't want to go through all my boxes. But it's called Lone Wolf and Cub. A lot of people may know it as Shogun Assassin. But it's Lone Wolf and Cub. And it came based, these books came out right after, I think, the it got popular in the U.S. But anyhow, these are done by Frank Miller, the first couple issues. You get number four. You get another copy of number four. You get issue number six. You get issue number seven. And I think after seven, Frank Miller stopped doing it. You get issue number eight. Oh, no. He's still doing it. Or is that nine? Let me That's see. number eight. Number eight. Okay. Issue number nine. Okay. Frank Miller's still doing it. Issue number... 16 issue number 19 so you get all these goodies while you're sitting there at your home nice and comfortable look up what these bad boys go for on the bay and also you can look them up on clz if you're high speed like that and you spend the money for a clz account it's your loss if you don't bid on them not my loss because it's a loss for me. Well, actually, it's a loss for me if you bid on them. And if you don't, it's not a loss. All right, so bidding starts at 30 bones. Good luck. I'm going to throw these on the side in the meantime and just start showing you guys some random buy nows. 
sorry, I'm looking at the screen rather than at the camera, which is rude of me. I know. <laughs> You're fine, man. All right. What's up, Purple Mystic? How you doing, man? All right. So that auction will start off at $30 while he's showing everything else, man. Make sure you guys are getting in there. Some awesome Frank Miller craziness. Yep. 70 buy it now. Uh, Wolverine V version 3, number 67. First appearance of uh, Spidey's daughter, and it's signed by Steve McNiven. It's right there. I showed this last week, I believe. McMuffin. McMuffin. Oh, that's not for sale. I can't sell that. That's my sex man. I mean X Men. <laughs> we won't sell anybody. All right. Uh, no, it's another X Men. What the hell? Did I put a whole X Men in here? What the hell? Oh, here we go. Sorry, I moved a bunch. If you got the cash, you want to make an offer, hit me on IG. We could talk about this. This is Spider Man and his amazing friends, number one. The cartoon from the 80s. Hell yeah, man. That was one of my favorites. Keith Lackey is in at $30 right now on that Frank Miller lot. You got the cash, you want to make an offer, hit me up. Hey. One sixty for uh Amazing Spider Man number four with the remark from um uh I think it's Humberto. Yeah, Humberto Ramos and his signature. Nine four, first appearance nice. of Or if you want to do one forty, you can get it at nine six. No remarks. Um, DOT, Department of Truth, number one, signed by Jenny Frizen. We will do 5 0. Oh, first appearance of. No, can't do that one. <laughs> oh, no, can't do that one. Uh, hey, I have a discount on crack slabs. Well, slabs overboard. <laughs> Here we go. Gwen Pool Holiday Special. Uh, number one. We'll do 35 on this. If anybody wants, just let me know. And of course, the um, auction is still going on as I'm picking these uh, slabs up off my lap and off the desk. Because they didn't hit the floor, don't worry. There you go, man. So those are all up for grabs. If you guys are interested, make sure you guys are getting in there. Ask some questions right now. Keith Lackey in the lead or the Frank Miller lot. And we still got about 30 seconds left. So plenty of time for you guys to go ahead and get in there. And if you want any of those on the wall, just let me know. I will sell. I'm not afraid to. There you go, man. He'll make it happen. All you guys got to do is jump in and ask him some questions, man. He'll have some answers for you. Right now, Lone Wolf Club up for grabs. Keith Lackey in the lead at 30. I do go now, by the YouTubes. Now, if Keith Lackey's bidding on this, you guys know something's up. Yeah, man. <laughs> All right. Here we go. And end line is coming in. It looks Keith, like Keith Lackey. You are yours, brother. There you go, man. Congrats. Great get. That's an awesome grab, my dude. That is going to you, man. You guys better be jumping on these deals, man. Go look those up. You guys just missed an opportunity. Keith Lackey going to be taking it. There you go, my dude. Congratulations. We yeah. have Vincent. We happy? Yeah, we happy. I don't think I'm ever going to change that video. I don't even think I've ever read Monstrous. I don't even know what's up with that comic. Great movie. Yeah, man. Well, all right, man. Zarabinski, you're the man. We'll go ahead and we'll see you on the next round, man. All, all right. right. Let's go ahead. Let's head on over to Nate. What's going on, my man? Yeah. Let's show the buyer's giveaways. So you're going to go on the wheel. And then you get the, uh, you can choose. You get Witchblade number one. Or you can get Demon Wars, the Demon Spirits. Or you can get. Honor, protect, serve, beat, and burn. The police motto. 100%. Yeah. Uh, and then the first person to buy a bin 
for to win the auction if nobody gets any bins, you're gonna give Web Warriors a number one added to their box. That's the uh, giveaway for the round. Now let's show some of these bins. All right, so these, the first handful are gonna be $8 a piece. All right, so we got the, this beautiful Grim Virgin variant. I think that's an unknown comics exclusive. Uh, the many deaths of Layla Star number one, the foil. Oh, that's nice. So shiny. It's so shiny. Uh, Hulk number seven, the Michael Turner variant cover. Oh, you guys got a Turner up there. And again, these are eight a piece. Eight a piece. Eight dollars uh, a piece right now. So this one is Marvel Zombies Black, White, and Blood number one. This is the one in ten. Oh, that's cool. Pretty wild cover. Man. Speaking of Marvel Zombies, this is a uh, Marvel Zombies key. Ultimate Fantastic Four 22. The Marvel Zombies key. So any of those for eight bucks, can't go wrong with any of them. I do say so myself. And I got a couple more bins we'll show and then we'll get into this winner's choice. Uh, all right, so we got uh, $10 for the pair. You got Spider Boy one and two uh this is the first spider boy and chris krensky team up and then this one is for solo series first gutter ball and first helifino so oh, yeah. all the keys this is one of those that like i know 20 years from now i'm be kicking myself in the ass for selling <laughs> wow. you just better pick them up man Ten dollars for the set. That's for two, not just one. All the people that are like, "Oh man, I remember when I was selling like Ultimate Fallout fours by the fucking dozen for twenty bucks a piece." I'm like, "Oh man." <laughs> uh, and then so right here we got we have demons one through three, ten bucks. Those are all Capulos, right? They are all Capulo and Snyder. Snyder was the writer. Capulo did all the art. Yeah, man, those are dope, man. You guys need to pick those up. The artwork inside of those is just kick ass man you guys want to see something vile something nasty the bullo does some of his best work in those ten dollars man you get number one through three that's what i'm talking about yeah very good stuff actually and snyder's writing on that one is really good because it was like they were like you can have your own just run with it baby it's all Yo, you are gonna bend demon man that's a good pickup man it's got killer killer work in there mustard yes you also get the web warriors my look at dude. that oh shit. there you go man my dude believe it or not i was hoping nobody grabbed that demon set yeah man 10 bucks is a, a steal of a deal hell yeah man i got so i got some i got some actually some cool stuff in here that i think mustard gas is going to do but uh, we'll start this winner's choice off at. Maybe we're back in the madhouse. We'll do four bucks. We'll do four bucks for the madhouse, guys. Let's do it. All right. So, A, you got Marauders number one. Really awesome Psylocke action cover. Uh, B, you got this crazy Spider Man Stormbreakers cover. This is on the Pretty wild, man. Hell yeah. C, you got the Peanuts variant uh, for X Men and Fantastic Four. D is What If uh, Tomb of Dracula. So it's What If Dark Tomb of Dracula, number one. Uh, so in this one, Dracula actually gets a hold of Blade and, and hits him with that full bite. And uh, Blade is no, walk, no longer the Daywalker, he's just full vampire. Oh, wow. Uh, so this one is really cool. This is Alienated. Uh, this is issue four of uh, the Virgin Variants. Yeah, so this one is crazy. Uh, so this is Klaus. Klaus, number one. So it's oh, called wow. Claws and the Life and Times of Joe Christmas. 
Dude, that's uh, look at all the those fantasy figures on there. I would guess that's probably like uh, what is it? Um, so man. it's supposed to be awesome. Grant Morrison wrote it, and it's like I really don't like Grant Morrison. Yeah, what is it like? Fable, I guess what it's called. Well, it's supposed to be like this weird uh, fantasy about how Santa Claus turned into this immortal. Like Santa Claus, I think is supposed to be the kid. Oh wow. And then he takes the guy that was taking him around's name. I, I don't know. Like I said, man, Grant Morrison is either terrible to me or he hits it out of the park. And when he hits it out of the park, he does it for like 50 issues and then just stuffs the rest of them in the trash. And it annoys me. So. <laughs> uh, this is By Night, number one. This is the Unlocked Retailer variant. There you go. Uh, this is Good Luck, number one. Super foily. Super boily. Or Boom Studios. Uh, then you got Robocop number one. Pretty bitching cover. Oh, yeah. Look Whoa. at that, man. And Jay is uh, Buckhead. Uh, I think this is number one as well. Uh, this is the Final Fantasy VII homage cover. I was about to say, that's what it looked like. Was like what? Yeah, it looks familiar, right? Yeah. yeah. So that is it, man. That's what's in there. And like I said, man, whoever gets this, if you pick up that clause, if you read it, let me know. Because I want to read it, but it's just Morrison has burned me so many times, dude. And I just can't. I can't trust him anymore. <laughs> there you go, man. Make sure you guys are getting in there. We got Hot Mustard Gas in at four. Look in four or five or more. This is winner's choice. Exactly the way that it sounds. Winner does have first opportunity. First dibs, if you will, to go ahead and get the books that he or she wants. So make sure you guys are jumping in there, picking them up, getting in there. I mean, there's plenty of books in here for you guys to go ahead and go through, man. And Nate is giving you guys a hell of a deal. $4 for the start line. You guys be sleeping on it. I don't know what to say, man. Make sure you guys are wiping that spit off of that pillow because, man, you could be waking up, missing out on all of these books. Right, man. We got and, uh, Most of these are normally double that. Some of these are five or six, seven, but most of them are at least double. Like this one is a 10. The yeah. Emerge Psylocke coverage go for premiums. Yeah, man. Plenty of books in here to be had, man. So make sure you guys are jumping in. Like I said, Waiter's Choice, you can't always bank on the fact that you think Hey, man, my buck will be there. I'll just wait for the reserve. You get better get in there and fight for it because by the time the end line comes, he's only got one copy of those books. So if you really want it, you need to jump in there. Make sure you guys are getting it. Right now, we got Hot Mustard Gas at the lead at four. We still got a minute and 23 seconds on the clock. Plenty of time for you guys to go ahead and get it going. Make sure you guys are getting crazy up here in the Madhouse. We got plenty of deals, plenty of books. And by the way, man, what's up to everyone out there in the chat, man? If you guys are all watching, man, how are you guys doing today? It is Monday. We're getting through a new week, man. Hope you guys are doing well. There he is, Morrison. That son of a bitch. Ever since his run on X Men, man, I just I don't trust him because I was loving it, and then he just he ruined it so bad in like the last three issues. I was like, how did you even do that? Oh man. Oh, dude. Speaking of X Men, I will admit Cyclops was a badass in the the new X Men cartoon. I'm telling you, he's always been that way. You guys are. No man, when he jumped out of that, you know, I'm not gonna spoil it, but when he when he does that jump, you know what I mean? I was just like, oh man, that that's that was pretty slick. I dig it. That has to be like a Final Fantasy cover, right? That's what yeah, he said, Final man. Yeah, yeah, yeah. See, I'm I'm late. Sorry. <laughs> <laughs> oh man. There you go, man. All right, how much are guys in the lead? Looking for five or more. Inline going to be coming up soon, man. Make sure you guys are jumping in. Otherwise, make sure you guys are putting it in your dibs. So make sure you guys are getting the books that you guys are looking for. I was not expecting this to go for four. I mean, this is an easy claim all, I think. Yeah, man. You guys better jump on this before it is too late. Let me go ahead and check at where it is at. All right, here we yeah. go. YouTube going by that end. Here we go, man. Make sure you guys are jumping in there. Wow. And Congratulations, Mustard Gas. Good, good man. On you, my dude. Jump in there. Pick whatever letters you guys want. And if you guys, there's plenty of books that are in here, man. So make sure you guys are getting in there and taking what you guys want. You guys have full opportunity to go ahead and get on these books, man. 
Can't guarantee Hot Mustard Gas is not going to tear that whole pile apart. Okay, so this is the unlocked retailer variant on G. The foil on H. Cool any book there. Robocop. Numero uno. Uh, Final Fantasy Seven homage. So he wants I J on if. He wants Jif. That's good peanut butter, man. So that's F. So that's the Klaus. I and J. Okay, okay. I'm always surprised to see what people get because there's some things where I'm like, oh, they'll for sure, and then they're like, no, these other ones. Yeah, so man, it's always people, cool to see everyone's taste in books, man. Yeah, but some people that I know, kind of what they're into, it, it's still kind of surprising. Maybe because they already got some of the other stuff. All right, make sure you guys are getting in there. Plenty of books, man. So get in there, get it going. Get in that box. And by the way, Nate packs his box like they're Teflon. They're bulletproof. Make sure you guys are getting in there, man. He knows what he's doing. Uh, what is E asking Hot Mustard Gas? So E, this is alienated for the Virgin variant. That was pretty dope. Cool. Me book from, let me see. Um, -na 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 -na. Is it Boom? It is Boom Studios. Boom Studios. See? Yeah, I went to school. Boom. I know things. Okay? <laughs> you don't know shit. Oh, I, I do what I want. Did I say that out loud? Yeah. Lady B's not here, so I do what I want. But that is E version variant for Alienated number four. Pretty cool cover for sure uh good luck number one the foil and that is the run of the winner's choice there you go ben all right so make sure you guys are getting in the dms you guys see anything you guys like man get in there build up that box take your pick man all right so anything that you guys see here you guys go hit up nate on the igs get it going let him know we'll make it happen man well all right Nate, we'll see you on the next round. Yeah, next round I'm going to do a DC Comics Presents Winner's Choice. It's nice. There you go, yeah. man. We'll catch you on the next round, man. Hell yeah, man. It's going to be yeah, awesome. Yeah, cool stuff, man. If you, want to, if you want to think about it and add it later, Mustard Gas, you can let me know. There you go. Get him up. Appreciate you, my guy. Thanks, everybody. All right, man. We'll circle back. Let's head on over to Cat60. What's going on? All right, so for... Oh, I fucking turned the camera on. I'm an asshole. Asshole. <laughs> okay. I, uh, <laughs> still confusing button. So for my uh, fire giveaway, um, I've got Star Wars... Um, I think this is volume two, uh, number one, trade paperback. And then this, uh, <laughs> it's a freaking huge book. Rise of the Sith. It. It's, a, it's like a $34 book. God. Uh, Star Wars, uh, Rise of the Sith. So these two trade paperbacks. That's going to cost a lot of fucking shit. These are yeah. $2 claims. Um, I got three nine, uh, Hulk 398, Thor number nine. I think that's from the Kate's run. X Men Legacy number 223, uh, Hellions number five, um, Lazarus Planet, um, Alpha number one, uh, Incredible Hulk 357. 325, I, I don't know why that's up there. It's the anniversary edition. Um, Evil Ernie Revenge, number four. Uh, Batman, 568. And X of Swords. They're so hard to figure out what they are. Um, 11. 
There you go. I was about to say, you know what they are? They're kick-ass. That's what they are. All right. The X and the swords are dope. $2 oh, claims. Yeah. All right. We got Lady Death, the Merciless, going to claim G and H. So that's the Incredible Hulk and that evil Ernie. There you go, Ben. $2 claims, guys. Go ahead and get in there. Plenty of room for you guys to go ahead and take what you guys are looking for. And there's a whole lot of killer books up there, man. Look at the artwork on E. God. God, man. All right. Let's go ahead and get in there. $2 claims. He's going to go ahead and keep throwing them books up, man. Make sure you guys are picking up what you guys see. And if you guys claim all of them, it is $15 to so go ahead and clear the board. I will rapid fire, too. So, right. um, Jennifer Blood, number three, the TMNT uh, homage. And Panther, number one, uh, the TMT number one homage. homage 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 there you go man all right two dollar claims claim all for 15 dollars man thunderbolts number one oh i'm gonna toss in a new book 351 spawn no no span oh i thought um, you said spam i was like what span the W silent. Oh, okay. <laughs> Scarlet Witch number eight. Oh hell no, I'm not putting that in. <laughs> you just better I'm get fucking, books, man. I'm crazy, but I ain't stupid. I ain't throwing that in. Oh, what the fuck? <laughs> Here you go, here's a nice butt. Guard 243. Holy crap! Yeah, fucking 25 center. Holy crap. Batman, year three, um, part three. This is 438. And then this is part four of four. Uh, 349, Batman, year three. Avengers, number 27. This is the Venomized. West Coast Avengers, 17. All right, Savage Avengers, number three. This is when they were doing all those Predator uh, covers because Marvel acquired the rights to print Predator. Um, the 10th, one half. This is a wizard. I mean, this is a, not a freaking $2 Oh, God, man, you guys got some wizard up there. A whole bunch of books. $2 claims, man. Get it going. All right, man. We still got two minutes on the clock. So I need time for you guys to go ahead and get these books. Get up there. A through J. That's all it's going to be, man. You guys see something that you guys like, go ahead and claim that letter. $2 claims. And if you guys want to claim all, it is $15 plus. You guys go ahead and get on a wheel for a buyer's giveaway. It's pretty simple, man. Just go ahead and pick up those books. Take them home. You guys see something that you guys like? Pick it up. Take it, throw that letter out there, make it happen. All right, man. Still got about a minute and 54 seconds on the clock. That spawn is looking pretty sexy up there, if I do say so myself. Same, man. You guys better get it's in a there. It's a dollar off cover. It's a brand new book. Yeah, man. I don't even know what this is. Detective it's Comics right. 983. That's pretty dope Batman book. There you go. Vampirella 25th anniversary special. Oh, for Zeta cover too. Marauders 15. Doc Cop said he will take them all. So you mean all that's up there? Or do you mean all that was on the previous board? Let us know Doc Cop because we'll do it either way. So we'll make it happen. Pause real quick while he the sides of what he wants to do. Are we are we going with this? It's fifteen dollars. Doc cop, let us know what you want to do, man. Because you want to take all of that right there, the ten up there now. So it's those right there, that ten. There you go. So yep, he's gonna take A through J on that right there. So congrats, man. Doc cop, that's all yours. 
It's just that easy, man. All you guys got to do is just claim all just like that. You guys be getting some books, making it happen. And what's up, by the way, Doc Cop, man? Dude is out there fighting crime, saving lives all at the same time, man. Does He does both. Doctor and a cop. Same time, man. Stethoscope and he's got a sniper scope. You know, two different hands. Sniper scope. Yep. Got both of them. All right. All right. So, so, let's see if I can put these back where they were. Marauders, number 15. It's a freaking dope cover. The art yeah, it is. Dope. Vampirella, 25th anniversary special. Um, Batman. 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 The Authority, number three of five. Don't know what that is. No idea. It's the Authority. Incredible Hulk. Number four, or number four thirty. Yes. Wait, the authority say is that say the authority and Kevin? Yes, it does say Kevin. <laughs> oh man, that's amazing. Uh the uh what wait, what does this say? Oh yeah, Ritz, I forgot to change it. That's my fault. Uh the magnificent uh, Kevin, that's what it is. The magnificent Kevin, man. Hey! <laughs> Kevin! Kevin! New Team Titans, number 12. Master of Kung Fu, 113. This is a kind of a beat-up book, but it's okay. And Master of Kung Fu, 101. 50 Center, 60 Center. Um, Cave Woman, number 2. There you go. Daredevil double size issue 190. Hey man, you guys got some craziness going up there, man. What the hell? <laughs> All right, man. We still Dude, got about another. This has got to be a fucking. This has got to be a key. Oh, uh, we do got Tony and Y going to take B. That Vampirella. It's Kevin McAllister. Oh God. E Man Thundercats number four. Oh. We also got PSK going to take I, that cave woman. All right. I thought that guy's is dope. That He Man, who would win that? I got I got Dibs and Lionel. I don't know. It's because he's kick ass. Got Doc Cop going to claim C, that Batman. Let's go. Doc Cop's going to take Batman. Uh, Batman. Doc Cop is taking Batman. Batman. No, Kevin. There you go. Poor Kevin. Kevin's down. <laughs> oh, man. All right, man. How's everybody doing out there tonight, man, while we're getting some of these books, man? Hit that thumbs up. And also, I was asking that question seriously, man. If you guys Have you guys seen that new X-Men 97, man? That thing is dope. I don't care what you guys say. I, I, I can't freaking... I can't sell this because I think this is a freaking pretty good key. It's uh, Titans number two. Doc Cop is going to claim H, Master of Kung Fu, on the right, right next to that Batman. Right next to the Batman. Hold on a second. You good, man. You good. Which one? Uh, Master one? Kung Fu, next one. This that one. one. Yes, sir. Yeah, th this one's in fairly good shape, so. And then Evan is coming through, going to claim J, that daredevil. Dare you. Oh. Evan. We also got PSK going to take the Panther on H. And then we got Doc Cop going to claim I, some more Batman. Nerdy Teens Collectibles. What's up? What's good? So Doc Cop gonna take that Batman as well. Let's see what else we got, man. Batman. Batman. The Lady V loves it when I do that. She's gonna do that. Oh, one. I bet. I bet oh, she's yeah. like, oh, dude, please. When we're having sex, keep, call me back. Keep doing it. Keep doing it. <laughs> <laughs> X-Men Legends, number one. Oh, there you go, man. Uncanny X-Men 313. Um, 
I don't know what this is. Um, Contest of Chaos, no. Venom number one. Oh, that, look at that artwork. All right. So here's a, a McFarlane homage um, of Ninja Funk signed by probably JPG. It's out of here. There you go, man. God, if we got Tony White to claim the Venom. New Defenders, 130. Uh, Amazing Spider-Man Annual number. It just says 1997. I don't know what it is. But only ballers can get those. Ballers? Uh, what? Batman 21, uh, zero year. All right, we got in line that is coming in. We also got Tony and Y. He's gonna claim A for the Venom. He wants it. We also got uh PSK gonna claim that Ninja Funk on B. First one in there. This is Tony. Yeah, that that Ninja Funk's not a fucking two dollar book. Yeah, man. We also got uh okay, so PSK gonna get B. And then let me know when you're ready. Yep. Doc Cop is going to get D and E, that's Spider-Man, and he's also going to get that Batman Zero Year. There you go, man. Batman. Batman. All right. There you go, man. Well, all right. You guys see anything else you guys like? How does nobody picked up the Magnificent Kevin? God! <laughs> so, like, Kevin. not trying to not trying to screw Cat 60 over, but that book on H is, like, going ballistic right now because of the show. Yeah, man. Pick it up. You guys got a chance. Hey, look, it's Cyclops. All right, man. Well, hey, we'll see you in the next round, Cat. Awesome stuff. You guys want to go ahead and hit up Cat60. It's scrolling at the bottom. Let him know what's up. Let him know what's good. Go ahead and uh, send him some dope memes. He likes those, too. All right, man. We'll see you. Yes, I like I like uh, feet pics. There you <laughs> go. Don't take them all. All right. Let's go ahead and head over to the PSAs right quick, real quick. And then we'll go ahead and jump into the next round because we got a whole lot of stuff coming your way. So, big shout out to our brethren right next door. Yes, sir, man. They got a Paul and his big pink room. So, make sure you guys are going over there and checking about Strictly Comics, the affordable comic auction. They got a whole bunch of stuff going on over there, man. And, uh, yeah, I heard that Paul got the auction shut down yesterday. What are you doing, Paul? Come on, man. What are you doing? Make sure you guys are... Uh, Getting that thumbs up and going and subscribing and getting that stuff going over there, man. They got a whole bunch of crazy stuff going on. And uh, you'll see a lot of our bad housians going on over there and uh, vice versa, man. So make sure you guys are checking them out, doing your thing. Also, big shout out to all of our patrons, man. If you guys are on the Patreon, you guys will be getting your exclusive quarterly shenanigans art prints. Basically, the longer you are on the Patreon, the more it chisels away at what that print is going to cost. So... That's pretty much the way it works, man. Go ahead and jump on there. Every single member on the Patreon will go ahead and get one of those prints. And you guys also get the monthly entry onto the giveaway wheel. So, I mean, talk about getting a whole bunch of something, man. Also, it includes the channel members. If you guys are on the channel member, you guys will get on the shout out graphic as well. You guys get a little bit of swag in the chat. And you guys are also going to get on the entry for the monthly giveaway as well. So, make sure you guys are jumping in on that. And we'll go ahead and uh, let you guys know we're going to do the giveaway on the next show so i'm going to make sure that you guys have a whole bunch of goodies to have to put up the graphic and and moving forward we're going to have the graphics going on uh ahead of time so you guys don't have to wait last minute sorry getting back on my feet getting things done around here on the madhouse so let's go ahead let's jump right into it on to the next round with Matty freeze what you got man what's up what's good what's up uh again uh just doing two dollar pull box so everything in the box is two dollars tell me how many pulls you want and you will get some cool books like i said there's a very good amount of there's some twenty dollar thirty dollar fifteen dollar all variations bronze silver sexy i don't know if there's any nudes there might be a nude in there i don't know it's a bunch Maybe. of stuff could be and then the buyer giveaway there's only one person on the wheel right now that is psk so buyer giveaway is Winter Soldier, the trade paperback, and Cosmic Ghost Rider, the trade paperback. So you get to find out about the Cosmic and find out about the Silver Arm Man. So those are there for you. And if you want any pizzles, let me know. Move my mic a little bit. 
<laughs> so yeah, like I said, I maybe next round I'll go through and show you some of the like if there's no traction, show you some of the fifteen twenty dollar books and then replace them back in there. But I wanted to leave it a little bit of a mystery. Like I said, there is a bunch in here. There's more than like in this whole thing right here. There's probably at least I'd say about. 15 to 20 if not more of 20 dollar plus books and there goes that when my shoulder hits it again god damn it i'm so fucking jacked <laughs> <laughs> so, yeah. oh man two dollar pull box guys make sure you guys are getting in there oh man god damn it man <laughs> so we got a two dollar pull box you guys want to go ahead and get in there's a whole lot of crazy books that are in there so make sure you guys are taking the opportunity to go ahead and get some of those books, man. Do it. Yeah, I know. Like I said, uh, there's a couple in here that people are going to be like, that was two bucks. And like, yeah, that's what happens. Yeah, man. When you're, when you're a madman at the, the House of Lunatics, this is what happens. Yeah, man. You've been uh, sipping on that happy sauce a little too much. It's true. Gatorade. It's very, very true. It's, it's a Gatorade or it's a high C. It's one or the other. They're both happy sauce. <laughs> Side story, I never forget. Like my one buddy who has pretty similar taste like me, he was like, Prime is like the greatest drink ever. It tastes so good. That's and then I couldn't wait for it. I was like, Oh man, he has great taste. It's gonna taste so good. I bought a case, like a fucking idiot. Dude, it tasted so gross. There was four fla there was three flavors, and they all tasted like they had like that kind of like weird diet taste where it's like flat taste. Yeah, like very, very gross. And there was like, I was like, dude, I hate you. You made me spend like fucking it, $35 it on it. like the when, when you get like that giant pack of like 500 popsicles, right? And, and it's like $3 for all the popsicles. Yeah. And when you let it melt, that's what fucking Prime tastes like. <laughs> all the leftovers, the sloppy seconds. Right, which for like a popsicle where it's just like a sip of it, it's cool. Yeah. But like the entire bottle of it is like just, oh my God, it's too much. It's yeah, too much. Oh, man. I can't do it, man. I haven't had it. I've heard people say it tastes like Diamond Tap. You guys remember? What? Yeah, it, it's weird. It's I'm not not a fan of it at all. Let me make sure that it's 10. I'm bad at math. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Okay. All right. First up. Oh, this is a one shot. Oh, well, let me not look at him and show what you got. Uh, that is a one-shot passive-aggressive. That is a uh, bad idea. I don't even know which one it is. I know there's one that's like more expensive than the other. If you open it up, it says, like, I don't know, there's some other thing. My brother knows it better than me. But, like, one's passive, one's aggressive. If you open it, you find out. So, mystery. Then you got, this is the uh, Fortnite. It's still in the poly bag, so you can get the code and go play some characters in Fortnite. Then you got this one used to be a big key. This is a Batman issue number three ninety nine. That's uh, the headless cover. Then you got Marvel Age number fifty three preview of the Silver Hawks. Then you got I Breathe the Body number four, just a cool oh, monster cool. kind of cover. I don't know what is underneath her, but she looks pretty sick. Another Fortnite zero point. I think that is issue number one. I could be wrong, but I think it is. Oh, no, it's issue five. Ah, hold on. There's more. Oh, uh, ooh, wait. What the hell? <laughs> that is uh, Origin of Binary. That's what it was on there. So, yeah, Origin of Binary. That is a key. Uncanny X Men number 163. Then you got another Marvel Age number 47. Don't know what's going on on that cover. Then you got Flaming oh. Carrot Comics number 28. That's with a little Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtle. I don't know what appearance this is, but it has to be an early appearance of the Turtles. And then there was a $15 pull in there. That is Army of Darkness, Stray Dogs number two. The AOD Fleeks variant was in there for two bonesers. So not bad at all. Not at all, man. There you go. Make sure you guys are getting in there. That's what's up, man. You guys don't know what you're going to get. Just $2 a pull. So make sure you guys are getting in there. Get yourself some of those pulls. Right now, we still got about a minute and 10 seconds on the clock. So if you guys think about it, don't think too hard. Just go ahead, jump in there, get them pulls going. It's also going to take $2 a pull, man. Thank you, Doc Cop. Yeah, man. Like I said, like there is more in here. I know there's a lot of crazy stuff. And 
I know it's gonna happen. It's gonna be super annoying, but someone's gonna be like, give me 10 pulls, and it's gonna be every single one that's like $15. It's gonna happen. Teresa gonna do 10 Teresa pulls. with 10. One, right. two, three, four, five. Yeah, while you're doing that, I'm gonna open up the door one second and let the cat out. Yep. One Eight. second, be right back. Nine. And number 10. 10 for Teresa. Let me make sure that is 10. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. All right. Put that one at the end because that is a biggie. So first up, we got, I think this is the second print of Spider-Verse. The first appearance of Spider-Boy. That is the second print cover. Then, let me do it this way. Eww. Yeah, Little Archie. This is an old-ass one. 118, as you can tell some archie in there then we got daredevil the man without fear number 293 uh dark crisis number one i know she likes her dc books then another one would be uh which one that is book number one does that have a card too eh, no card Ooh. that was a key that is the first appearance of blade's daughter that was the judgment day then <laughs> weird love number seven i don't know what the hell this is about there's a sex club that someone joined <laughs> but, uh, no, you know, weird no. love? that's Jesus. very <laughs> nice yeah. suicide club B black files issue number one another zero point issue number six still in the poly bag and you got the uh, Justice Society of America number one, the Zerdy Virgin variant. That was a twenty dollar pull. You got for two dollars. Hell yeah, some of that dirty yeah. dirty, man. And then I think I PSK won another ten. Yep. Yes, sir. We just buy Teresa on that one second. Teresa ten pulls. Beep, bop, boop, 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 boop. And now PSK one, <laughs> two. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. All right, let's see what we got. That's cool. That's all right. Not bad. Bing, bong, bing. Oh, I think that's actually a pretty big key. Ew. Oh, well, you got it. All right, so here we go. This one, I think this is like a six or seven dollar book. That's oh, Return yeah. of Pain, uh, part four. No idea what that is, but it's there. Then a zero point. Damn, there's a good amount of these. That is the and still in a poly bag. That's issue number two. Inhumans issue number two. So that's an oldie in there. Then Red Goblin, uh, Spider Verse. That is a variant. Another zero point still in the poly bag. That is actually one of the variant covers, too. Nope. Then Marvel Tales issue number 268, Hobgoblin. I don't, I just remember this one as a kid. I remember being a cool cover. This one's actually really cool. Uh, hard as hell to find. This is Venom number 30. I don't know what run this is, but he's eating a Subway sandwich and like, like, I don't know what the fuck he's doing. He's just eating a sandwich on top of a guy. <laughs> You got also this is uh, Mad Balls versus Garbage Pail Kids, the one uh, number one version variant, and then this one I think is kind of a key. I'm not positive if that's a big book, but I think it is. That's Marvel Age number nineteen. It's with a Black Spider-Man cover, so I don't know, could be a big one, but it's in there. And then also he got his sexy book. It was in there. That was one of the Helena number one. I don't know Ooh. what year this is from, like. Fucking 1632, but that was in there by Light <laughs> Comics. <laughs> is so, uh, pronounced Hell in ya? I guess. Helena? Helena? No, uh, Hell in ya. Hell in ya. Hell in ya. So okay. that yeah, was. One. I got it. I got it. That was PSK, so I'll put that over there. And then I think Teresa wanted. Oh, damn, this round's going to be crazy. All right, so we have Brew with 10 and then 10 more from uh, Teresa. Yes, sir. So one, two, three, four. 
Chaz said, put a little poop in there. Six, <laughs> seven, eight, nine, ten for Brewer. And then I could still restock this. I know it's getting low in there, but don't worry. I got more to go in there. Let's see what's going to get. That's there. That's cool. That's cool. Damn. All right, let's go through these. Uh, some old ass Thor, probably worth money. It's actually like near mint. This is the Mighty Thor issue three twenty three in a newsy. Then you got Batman versus Predator issue number two. That is like a trade paper. Then Marvel Age issue number thirty one with whoever that dude is. Not her. I mean this little dude. This like weird little Wolverine guy. Mm -hmm. Then Creep Show. This is a variant issue number four, I believe. Like some wrestling shit, but pretty cool. Uh, Robocop versus Terminator issue number two. Basket full of heads, I believe that is. Issue number two. No, that's refrigerator full of heads. <laughs> Invaders number 40. Another oldie. Then this was a key. Forgot what the hell it was, but I, the Titan. First oh. Titan hole. See, there you go. Then this one's actually very hard to find. I couldn't find any comps on it. It is Bishop issue number one, Xavier Security something. Maybe it has some value. I have no idea. Yeah, it's but... just got Bishop on there. That's all you need. Yeah. And then this one has crazy value for strange reason. I only had it at 10. This is the Immortal Hulk issue number 19. Some people would sell this for like $25 to $30, but it was in there for 10 bonzers. So there you go. I think that might have been it for that. Yeah. So that was David Brewer with 10. Yeah. Let me just write that. Damn. Then I'll get Teresa. David B. And then Teresa and I am ending my round. So let's see. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight nine and let's get this one yeah. 10. all how right bizarre. let's see how bizarre oldie oldie let's see let's see something that's another one of weird uh i'm gonna grab her one extra one because i'm not too happy with this so let's see <laughs> sure why not all right spider verse i don't know some variant Probably worth like thirty-seven thousand dollars, but it's in there. <laughs> Midnight Tales from God knows when, old as hell. That is in there. That's uh by Charlton. Marvel Age number thirty. Some dude with a bunch of ants. Champions issue number twenty-five. Fantastic Four. I think this is a key. Uh, that is issue two thirty-three. Then you got the lot issue number two. That's a bad idea book. Invaders number 22. Most of these are usually keys that were, my brother was saving. Uh, Batman zero point issue number one, still in the poly bag. Then uh, Three Jokers. That one, let's see, does that have a card? God damn it, no card. And then I don't know why. Here's another one. This one. This has some weird kind of value. It's definitely near mint. This is Black Lightning issue number eight. I saw something they said like some have a special thing in here that makes it like a $300 book. I don't know what it is. Maybe it's in there and you got it. No idea. But it's a very nice copy. Something's Killing the Children issue number 25. And I think that was it. Yeah. So that was all Teresa. So Hell yeah. Bye. There you go, man. Well, all right. Yeah, you guys see what's in that pull box, so make sure you guys are getting in there. Make sure you guys are taking advantage of it. Maddie's going crazy tonight, so, man, just like the rest of this panel, man, make sure you guys are taking advantage of it. All right, man. Thank you so much. And then I'm going to restock this, and it's pretty much probably going to be the end of the pull box after I restock it because I have nothing else to put in there. So All good. Thank you again. Right. Stay tuned, everybody. Yes, sir. And a big shout-out to Austin Caldwell for uh, hopping in on the Madhouse, man. You lunatic, we appreciate you, man. you have any questions, Feel free to jump in, man. It's not that hard. We'll help you out. I just All right. Nate. You bastard. Yeah, man. That Maddie's beard looks glued on like the guys is in the 90s movies. Yeah. All a little right, bit. Man. A little glow. 
Matt, you gotta you gotta bring back the Jackson Galaxy. It's gonna happen. All right. We'll get you on the next round. Yeah, man. All right. Let's head over to Zarabinsky. What's up, man? What's going on? All right. So we're gonna do a auction starting at 40. All right. Okay. Oh, look at that. This is something's killing the children. Comes with the card. It's limited to 500 copies. And I'm going to let it, let it go with the comic capsule. So starting bit of 40 on this. Oh, you guys need to jump in on this. It basically comes okay. with a nice hangable sleeve. You guys can put it in there. It's almost, you know, like a slab itself. There you go, man. $40. Yeah. It's fire. And it's the new version of the comic capsule. All right. And then I have a buy it now. We're going to do the $15. Comes with sweet paprika number one. I don't know which cover it is. Um, I don't know if it's the blank behind this or if it's one of the variants. Unnatural blue blood number one. If you guys didn't know, this is a peach momoko naughty book. Oh. She did the cover. Know. That's wow. Peach Momoko. And uh, Sushi, uh, number two. You can look these up. It's well over 15, but we'll just say it's 15. Buy it now. And uh, the slabs I showed earlier. But we'll hold this up. There you go. Uh -huh. man. So $40 is a hell of a book. Make sure you guys are jumping in there. Plus the COA. And you guys are getting what number is if something is killing the children. Asking Evan. Okay. This says number one. But I'm not sure if it's number 16. I don't know if BTC, uh, Big Time Collectibles, made a mistake. But it says, um, I'll put, put it right up there. Oh, yeah. Yeah, that's a gorgeous book. And on top of that, you guys are getting that, uh, what do you call those, man? Do they have a specific name? Which? The, the protector it's in. Oh, these, this is Comic Capsule, guys. Comic Capsule. Comic Capsule. This is what you've been seeing all over Instagram and everybody reviewing. It's Comic Capsule. It's basically a CGC case. You open up, put your comic in, seal it. It is great. There and you go, man. Wonderful on the wall. And you could they have um, a link with each one that you could, you could uh, get the QR code. And it'll do labels that you can print put on here just like cgc there you go man so make sure you guys are jumping in there man it's a foil for the 12th print of number one yeah so you guys get the coa make sure you guys are jumping in here you guys also get that uh that case too man tony and it's ready to go and hang up on the wall you guys can't beat it so make sure you guys are jumping in there zarbinski got plenty of books ready to go around and you guys will also get the entry on the buyer's giveaway as well so get in there get your spot also get some of that fire craziness he's got man i don't know how he's not wearing oven mitts holding that thing i would have burned my damn fingers off by now yeah this is look it up ladies and gents look it up and what i'm gonna do is i'm gonna pull uh just give me a number one to five i'm gonna pull out one of these mystery boxes and break it out and then i'm just gonna reshuffle the boxes so if anybody That's could cool. just uh type one to five do it but i'll pause it real quick while we figure out what's gonna go on man yeah, Nate, it's worth more now. You guys better jump in on that. Something's killing the children. I don't know where else you're going to be. Yeah, and the comic capsule itself is 10 bucks. Just to give you a heads yeah, up. Man. Uh, PSK three. said three. One, two, three. So we'll grab the third box. This is just to show you guys. Oh, wow. It's fucking heavy. All right. So this would be it there. It's uh, signed by Joe Rubenstein. And since that's in there, you have to throw in the Wolverine one at eight. Yeah, man. And then you're gonna have to throw in uh, Agents of Atlas, number one. God. Go and Chris. Nine, eight. Uh, four number one, God of Thunder, the uh, Halloween edition. Uh, Blaze. Uh, blah blah blah. blah. What is this? Number three. I'm just gonna pull out the whole stack. Why not? Oh. Uh, well, oh, craziness in that one. Yeah. Uh, threw in a little Zorro book on that one. Uh, 
Prelude to War. Um, Green Lantern. I don't. I don't know what issue that is. Uh, GI Joe Special Ops. Green Team. Captain America. Terminator Endgame. Daredevil. Don't know what number because I can't. I don't. Can't see with my glasses fully. First Wave. Civil War Two. Fantastic Four. X Men Number One. And uh, what is this? Oh, so David Nakayama. Hell yeah. So all that would have been in that, that box. And how much is each box? Each box is 200 200 you guys get the mystery. You guys get a signed, uh, some awesome art prints. And then you guys also get a couple slabs and some books. I mean, that's a hell of a deal, man. Make sure you guys are jumping in there, man. There you go. Time to get cooking, man. You guys also... What are those... Out? What are those giant books back there? Those giant boxes. What are those boxes? Those black ones. The, are those oh, books? those are um, believe it or not, short boxes. Oh God! You those can buy those boxes. on Amazon. I love them. They have handles on the side, right? You're no, no, no. down down below. Oh, down this. Below that. Yeah. This is um, wonderful books. You want to know why? You could hide your pistol in here. Ah, that's dope. <laughs> oh, that's crazy. Man. That's I was fucking those. dope. Yeah, these they guys. look like books, don't they? Yeah. yeah, they do. You got War and Peace, The Old Man in the Sea by Ernest Hemingway, Gone with the Wind, and War and Peace. Those are called it. No, he said called it. <laughs> oh, good. All right, guys. We got Tiber that is cooking, man. So you guys got that something is killing the children up there, up for grabs, and you guys are also getting that case with it too, man. Jump in yep. there, and hey. don't forget the naughties are up here. Yep, fifteen dollars. You got that old school Peach Momoko when she was first starting out doing naughty book covers. Yeah, to get your start somewhere, man. God bless her. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, man. All these books up for grabs, man. All you guys got to do is jump in. And he's got the mystery boxes. You guys want to go ahead and jump in on the mystery box? $200 for mystery box, man. Go ahead and see what you're going to get. A whole lot of craziness. And yeah, then each, some. Each box has two slabs, pretty much. Yeah, they all have two slabs, actually. Hell yeah, man. You guys and then whatever's slabs. on the wall behind me, just ask. Don't be afraid. Yep. Do not be afraid. I am selling at insane prices. It is up for grabs, man. You guys just got to jump in there and go ahead and take a pick it. Sarah Bisky will also work with you, man. Right now, we do got this something is killing the children up for grass. $40, man. I don't know where else you're going to be able to find this at at that price. Plus, the case ready to go and hang up on the wall, man. No need to submit to CDC. This thing is nice, protected, ready to go ahead and throw at somebody. They be talking some mess, walking in your house, man. You're like, hey, what's going on? Right in the face. That's hilarious, yeah. man. You know so it, it looks like the frizzing cover for number one, but it, that's not the frizzin foil, right? That's somebody else did an homage to that one. No, it's me. This is Nico Suyan. Nico Suyan. Oh, yeah. okay, okay, okay. Yeah. So he homaged the frizzing for the foil variant. Nice. Yeah. Kick ass, man. All right, guys. You guys better jump in there before it's too late. Don't know where else you're going to be able to find this at this price at. Tell you, man, the price for this is just climbing up, and you guys are also getting the case on top of it. Yeah, I was watching these. They sold out in like a day and a half. Yep. Only 500 made. Yeah. Damn. See, I need to get yeah, my hands dude, That's, they that's a deal them. because he's throwing that case in as well. It's a fucking $10 case. Yes. Mm -hmm. That's a deal and a half, man. You guys better jump on this before the end line you, comes you're in. You're not man. getting that on eBay. I just looked them up. I mean, uh -uh. No, I think the, the cheapest oh. one I found was uh, 60 bucks. There we go. We got Rebecca in at 40. Let's go and trigger it's not even in mint shape. Oh, awesome, Becky. This will go right into that short box, which is almost full. She has almost a full short box with me, ladies and gents. There you She's go. We have a ton of goodies soon. Hell yeah. Here we go with the overtime. You guys know the way that we do it. So let's go ahead and let's do it, man. No sniping in the madhouse. Let's make it happen. And slap the hell out of each other just like that, man. We got some overtime coming in. So we got 30 seconds on the clock. You guys are also getting this book with the case. The case isn't just for show, man. It's going to come in the mail. You guys can hang it right up on the wall. Get it going, That's man. Great. 
you take a command strip, slap it on the back, throw it on the wall. Looks like gold. Man, do you know if they're going to be coming out with more of those later on? Or was this like a uh, test run for them? No, no, they, they, they're legit now. That's it. They're good. They have, they have them in clear back. And this is the new version, which is the dark back. So you can get clear or dark back. You can check them out at Comic Capsule on IG. Or you yeah. could just type in Comic Capsule on Google and go right to their site and buy them. They have them in 1, 5, 10, 20, and 100 packs. If you buy a 100 pack, it's a lot cheaper than um, than 10 up. Uh, I would hope so. Yeah. yeah man. So right. That would be $1,000, dude. <laughs> yeah. yeah. And if, I... if my math is right. My math is never right. Even when I got my shoes off and I can cut my toes. Just saying. All right. There we go, man. End line is in. So congratulations to you, Rebecca Raider, getting yourself a hell of a deal, getting something nice from the Zarabinsky. He ain't playing, yep. man. It's yours, Becky. There you go. Congratulations, and you're going to be getting yourself on the wheel for the buyer giveaway as well, man. Some awesome stuff. Yes, I have a buyer's giveaway at the end of the night. We make it a surprise as usual. All right. This way Here for people go. that don't that, that haven't bought, they get the proverbial fuck you. you know, yeah, man. It fine. sucks, man, but you guys need to jump in there. And you guys be like, damn it, man. I should have jumped in on that. Well, all right. Yeah. All right. Appreciate you, man. We'll see no you problem. on the next round. All right. Alrighty. Let's go ahead and head on over to Nate. What you got, man? All right. The buyer's giveaway. Get you on the wheel every time you buy uh, anything. So you got Witchblade number one, the trade. Uh, you got uh, Demon Wars, the Spirit Demon, the trade. And you have Honor, Protect, Serve, Beat, and Burn, the trade. So you get to choose one of those, whichever one you want. And the first person to buy anything this round is going to get, this is Black Adam number two. This is the first Malik as White Adam. That's the giveaway for this round. So the first person to buy this round gets that. Now let's do some of these. Uh, I just got a few bins. And I got a really cool winner's choice. So here we go. Uh, so this is Blink number one, super high grade copy, twenty five bucks. I don't know why this goes for that much, but it's like consistently been twenty five or more for years. I mean, maybe because the ass out cover like i don't know what uh because it's not a key or anything i mean first solo series i guess but that's i don't think that justifies the cost um just people really like that cover i guess uh and then you got this set here she hulk number seven she hulk two and three seven oh range 25 for both so you get the second uh she hulk and then you get issue a number three $25 is also going to take, man. Get it. Jump in on it. 25 bonesers. Uh, and then we got... So this is uh, some ASM. So you got ASM 224. And Okay, so I don't got to tell you guys. You see it there? Star stamp right there. Yeah. So Mark Jeweler. Star stamp Mark Jeweler. This is issue 225. And this one is a Star Snap Mark Jeweler. This one is 228. Uh, so this one has the silver insert. This one has a silver insert. And this one has a blue insert. Uh, so I'll do any of these for 15 a piece. So if anybody wants any wow. ASM Mark Jeweler Star Stamp, 15 bucks a piece. $15 a piece, man. Hell of a deal, man. You guys get yourself some of that Mark Jewelers with the star stamp on it. There you go, man. Out the door. Make it happen, man. Yeah, so like I said, you got two, 224, 225, and 228. Oh, hey, Becky. I don't know. This chat falls asleep sometimes. Dude. It happens, um, man. Yeah. <laughs> But anyway, Mark Jeweler, uh, ASMs, if anybody's interested in any of those, let me know. MT wants to know how much for all of them. Uh, for all of them? Maybe, what, 45? I do 40 for all of them. There you go, 40. $40 for all of them. 
MT was the first one to ask, so I'll let him reserve the right. Up to him if he wants to go ahead and jump on that. You got to wait. Uh, so the second one is Luigi on the backup. MT is going to go ahead and take it. So there you go, man. Good All right. Man. Those are going to MT. There you go. Thank right. you, MT. I appreciate that. Um, so I'm going to start this off at, so we're going to do $4, $4 winner's choice. And these are all DC Comics presents. These are nice. I'm doing well, Becky. Thank you for asking. It's a, it's a grind though, man, uh, for sure. Uh, so this one is uh, DC Comics presents number 60. And these are high grade, high grade yeah. All right. MC said he's going to pass those over to Luigi Quick Stand. And Luigi said, nah, it's okay. So he said, uh, you guys, <laughs> just let me know in the chat. I know you guys all get given. But uh, yeah, just let me know. And then B, this is uh, first. Oh, man. It's the first appearance of someone, and it's the unofficial first appearance of Judge Dredd. Judge Dredd! Yeah, so like, oh, first appearance of Ambush Bug. That's what it is. Okay. Uh, And then the unofficial Judge Dredd, uh, because like he appears on like the balloon at a fair or something. Uh, And then we got this one is issue 34. Uh, Then we got DC Comics Presents 42. Got DC Comics Presents. 29 newsstand. It's an E. Uh, this one is DC Comics presents 43. Cool manga. Newsstand there. Uh, G, this one is 28. So this is the second appearance of Mongol. First, uh, first appearance of Reservoir and Origin of Mongol. So that's 28. Uh, and then H is uh, issue six. Newsstand. <laughs> so winner's choice. What I say, four dollars starter. Yes. <laughs> Plenty Southern of uh, goodies to choose from for sure. Oh man, Southern's coming in hot. That, that's how you know I undershot it. There you go, Ben. So right now we got four dollars on the lot right there. I think I always thought that was a kick-ass cover right there with Spectre on it. Oh yeah, this one's one of my favorite covers for sure. Yeah, that is kick-ass. I've always liked that. Got a whole lot going on, man. All right, right now we do got Southern Comic Geek in at four. Let me go ahead and put that timer up there. You guys got winner's choice. Exactly how it sounds, man. Winners have the opportunity to go ahead and go ahead and pick whatever he or she wants. So make sure you guys are jumping in. I do go by the YouTube as soon as the headline hits. Whatever the winner sets the price at, each book will go for that price. Right now, Southern is in at four. Here's the catch, though, man. If you guys are jumping in this at winner's choice, it is legitimately what it sounds like. Winner has the choice. That's what you guys are fighting for. You guys don't jump in. Cannot guarantee that your book is going to be there by the time that end line hits. So make sure you guys are jumping in A through J, man. You guys know your alphabet. You guys have an opportunity to go ahead and get the books that you want. You got Rebecca Raider in at five. Looking for six, man. Right now, you guys are fighting for that victory, man. Like I said, man, you guys grow up thinking you guys could be whatever you guys wanted to be. Be a winner today, man. Go ahead and jump in and get that choice. Choice of a lifetime. You guys go ahead and pick whatever book you guys are looking for. I said this is the bigger one. The second Mongol, Origin of Mongol, First Reservoir. And then that first ambush bug. And oh, thank you. Unofficial Judge Dredd is a pretty big one, too. I don't know. I've always thought Mongol looked a little cooler than uh, Dark Side. Kind of like a, like a Venom Carnage feel, you know what I mean? <laughs> I've always appreciated Mongol. Like, cool. All right. Here we go, I man. Thought he was like, I thought when I was younger, I thought they were the same character. And I, I thought that maybe somebody left dark side out or like mongol out in the sun and that was dark side (laughs) or someone forgot to color them man what's going on damn it 
All right, right now we got Rebecca Raider in at five. We do got another 40 seconds on the clock. Plenty of time for you guys to go ahead and jump in here. Winner's choice. It is going around. You guys make the choice on whatever book you are going to take. It's pretty easy, man. As soon as you guys are jumping in, you guys have an opportunity to go ahead and get some books before the end line hits. As soon as the end line hits. However, that is going to be the end of it. End line is king. There is no going back. It is what it is, man. You cannot turn back time. You ain't share. Let's go ahead and let's keep it going. We got 15 seconds before that end line drops. We got Southern Comic Geek jumping in at six right now. Right now. Here we go, man. End line going to be coming in shortly after the OT. You guys remember how we do it, man. Any bids within 30 seconds or multiple active bidders. Oh, wait. We got a fold. So that will round us out to an end line unless somebody beats me up to the end line coming in. Let's go ahead and let's see what's going to happen. And here we go. Drop it. That end line. There it is. Boom! Looks like Southern is going to be taking it for six dollars. Rebecca tried, went in there swinging, but it happens. There you go, man. Just like me with the bat to a pinata, man. I missed like ten times before I hit something, and it ain't damn pinata. I'll say that much. All right, who is or what is Southern Comic going to take home? I mean, you could take someone off the panel home, Southern, but it's totally, totally up to you. We got F and G for Southern. The Mongo. There you go, man. All right. So Southern is taking these home. And Rebecca said whatever is left. So she's cleaning the slate, man. And Rebecca is taking the rest. So those are for Miss Becky. Now, was it was it MT that took the that did get the Mark Jewelers, the ASM? So, Mark uh, Luigi said, yeah, pass it off to uh, MT because you know they discussed it, and uh, yeah, so it's going to MT. All right, so MT is getting that one too since he was the first one, first one in on the action. There you go, man. Action Jackson coming through, man. All right, man. Thank you I so do. much, everybody. I will be back next round. Next round, I think I'm going to do an Iron Man Builder. So here's a preview. Oh, look at that, man. Oh, that one's kick-ass, dude. I dig those masks on there. Yeah, so we're going to do a cheap Iron Man Builder next round, my friends. Damn, man. You got a whole lot of books coming your way, man, of the Iron brand. So, hey, we'll see you on the next round, my dude. We'll catch you then. All righty. Let's go ahead and head on over to El Gato 60. What's going on, man? That's how they say it in Mexico, if you didn't know. What's going on? All right, I have these. I have these. I don't know if anybody's going to be interested in them. Um, I can put them in new bags and boards. I just haven't done it yet. I've got some uh, Westerns. They're five bucks each. Gene Autry comics. Pop Long Cassidy. Um, a lot of these, I think some of these are gold age. Um, Bill Elliott comics. Gabby Hayes Western. Uh, Monty Hale Western. So, Western uh, comics, um, they're not in the best shape, but still, I mean, some of these are actually worth a lot of money. So, I got those five bucks each if you want. There's five of them, 20 bucks for all of them. Well, all mean... right. Two dollar claims, buddy. Two dollar claims. Two dollar claims, or Rebecca's yeah. going to bend the Westerns, by the way. Okay. Um, Amazing Adventures, I got 4, 7, 8, 11, 13, and 14. Uh, those are the X-Men uh, reprints. Um, New Teen Titans, number two. I think, I can't remember. This is from the 80s. It's from the 80s. Um, Edge of Spider-Verse 4, Hard Case, number one. Mom, number one, cover A. Two dollar claims. There you go. Two dollar claims, and the uh, the westerns were twenty bucks, right? Twenty bucks for all of them. Yeah. Okay. That I was just clarifying because uh, Evan was talking about claim all for twenty, but Rebecca got it first. Evan hit live, man. C Fab. I've got more. Are good, my dude. I've got oh, more. Go. So yeah, so he'll hook you up, man. All right. Well, uh, break out next dude. round. Feel better, man. One day at a time, my dude. Miss you, man. I want to see what that name says. CFAP returns. You walk over return, my dude. I'll miss you, bud. All right. We are taking oh, no. down, man. We got four minutes on the clock, man. Plenty of time to go ahead and get your claims. 
my favorite Batman cover. <laughs> <laughs> Batman oh, four thirty five. Um, four thirty. The Robin collector pack in a in a um in a poly bag. I'll put that in a bag and board if you want it. Um, Rocket Man number one. Okay, Dang. I think that's a ripoff. That's not the Rocket Team. Batman five twelve. Batman six sixty seven. Killer oh, Azrael cover. Yeah. Um, Nightfall eighteen. This is Batman six six six. A little satanic there. I don't think Bane's wearing any Johns, man. I think he just came out of the skinny. <laughs> he's gonna, he's gonna mouth dick Batman, is what it is. Yep. <laughs> Super Pro Super Bowl Special Collector's Edition. Don't know if there's an issue number on it. Semper Fi number one. Oh. Oh, I'll, I'll hold the, I'll hold off on these because. Uh, these are these are Southern comic geeks shit. Eternal Look Warrior that. Ten. Yeah. Yeah, we got you, Rebecca. You good? All right. So make sure you guys are jumping in there. Two dollar claims. You guys want to claim all that's on the board? It is fifteen dollars, man. Don't be shy. Jump in there. You guys can get your spot for the winners giveaway. So make sure you guys are jumping in there. Three minutes on the clock. Plenty of time for you guys to go ahead and take whatever you want, man. You guys want to go ahead and get that comic right there. With Batman being surprised that, damn, Bane is naked as hell, just two feet away from me. Why is this in my face? Make sure you guys are jumping in there. That is A through J, man. Go ahead and get in there and pick up some of them books. Do it. Plenty of craziness up here on the screen, man. Oh, no takers, no takers. None yet, man. Deathmate, the prologue. Oh. Death Bay won um, the yellow and the red. Those are Southern Comic Geek specials. Yeah, there you go, man. Hulk 450, Make sure you go. Hulk 452. Hulk 314. Oh, um, I'm not selling that. That's garbage. Garbage. Three ninety two. Oh, really? No, I can't. Holy sell crap! That. Did you see that? It's, I can't sell this one either. I think it's a twenty five dollar bus. Ah, that might get fucked on this one. New Teen Titans number sixteen. Oh, you guys better get in there, man. Get them claims. You saw those books that are going up, man. Cat six is slowly slipping into I hate comics mode. Yes, first uh, Blackfire, right? Yeah. Oh, Spawn Spawn bitch, Son of a bitch. God damn it, cat. <laughs> Fucking crazy, man. I'm crazy, man. I ain't so crazy. You don't tell me what to do. I'm crazy. <laughs> Shit, dude. This is a good book. You guys got me <laughs> Over here, like my grandma. <laughs> grandma, what do you want to eat dinner today? Applebee's? Ablabes? What? Just came out of your face. <laughs> Ablabes. We got uh, Ryan McDonald going to Ben E and J. You, I, Ryan, you lucky SOB. Yeah. I don't even know why those are in there. I know. I hate you just a little bit, Kat. Uh, I know. I hate me. <laughs> <laughs> we got <laughs> Tim Koski is going to claim A and B and C. There you go, man. These are two dollar claims. Claim all. I'm surprised Southern Comic Geek didn't take those. He's probably got fucking fifty of them. Though. Man, he probably tried to sit back down at his chair and miss. We got PSK going to claim I. I say I say that out of experience. That shit happened to me two days ago. That wasn't fun. This one. Uh, yes, sir. PSK. All day, man. Congrats, Congrats, PSK. That's a fucking dope book, dude. Yeah, man. 
All right, man. Make sure you guys are getting it. These are $2 claims across the board, man. As soon as he starts putting some more books up, I'll start that timer again. You guys see something you guys like? Go ahead and just drop that letter in the chat. It's just that easy. And if you guys are new, don't know what to do, make sure you guys are jumping in. We'll help you out, man. Pretty easy. Hold 308. Oh, Damn, what man. Me? You got that, uh... I don't know, man. That looks like UFC illegal right there. Hulk getting choked the hell out. I hope that's his tail. Holy fuck. The, the, the rest of this shit should be for next round. Oh, there you go, man. man. All right. So you guys heard it. I'm going to run that clock. So you guys see something that you guys like, go ahead and jump in there. I was waiting for him to go ahead and reset. But, hey, we're saving it for next round. So make sure you guys are jumping in there. Plenty of opportunity to go ahead and get them books. You guys see something you guys like? Yeah, I, can, I can't put these up. I'm gonna do a cart. I'm gonna do cartoon books uh, next round. Cartoon books on the next round, man. See some of them tunes, man, moving around. You guys know what it is, man. And you guys remember uh, the cartoon Doug by chance? And if you guys do, <laughs> yeah, yeah. You know what I've had stuck in my head all goddamn last week and this week there was an episode where uh the beats were on there and they had that song killer tofu and i can't get yeah. it stuck <laughs> oh we you killer tofu. I'm, I'm totally shocked that nobody took these fucking x-men dude no for grabs man jump in there make it happen quail man that's what i'm talking about mr collector quail me yeah yeah i'm surprised when he got those x-men I, I thought that's what Dude, look Enemy at that. And, and this Batman, too. Look at those fucking eyes. Batman. Batman looks like a giant pussy. <laughs> he shook his fuck. <laughs> yeah, yeah, he's fucking scared as fuck. A bat bat. That's, that's not Batman. Okay. <laughs> a bat bat. Make sure you guys are jumping in there. Plenty of books, man. Yeah, these X Men right here, dude, those are fucking, those are dope books. <laughs> Or or his own books up. It's like this shit right here, man. <laughs> that, shit, that shit is dope. <laughs> That's what the drug dealers say. This is dope. Yeah, I know it is. That's why I'm talking to you. <laughs> if you, if you, I will do it like when the round's over. He's like, you know. <laughs> so listen, if you don't have a woman, I know you guys are comic nerds. <laughs> Okay, uh. so you take those and you put them on your coffee table and you invite a chick over, you know, just as casual, like friends. She sees those books on the coffee table. You're getting laid, dude. Hey, yo! <laughs> Guaranteed, you'll get laid. Oh, man. Where's the other one? Oh, here we go. Speaking of Batman. Suck the fucking dick, Batman. Get up. There you go. All right. All right. <laughs> <laughs> All right, man. Well, hey, there you go, man. Get them. Put them on the coffee table, man. It'll work out. Well, all right, That's man. right. Any chick that comes over, you're getting laid. Just oh, my invite, God. Just, just be be very careful who you invite over when you leave those on the coffee table. Yeah. You don't want to invite your mom over or your sister. <laughs> yeah, she'll put you. Unless, put you unless you're in the South. <laughs> that flew right over my head until you said that. I was like, what? Oh my god. Oh hey man. We'll see you on the next round. And you know, it's Cat Six, he might be speaking like, hey man, he had him in his coffee table, he had to take him off. That's why he's selling them now. He's like, no, I'm good. All right. Dude, I was even getting I was even getting guys. Oh my god, man. It happens. It happens, man. Wait. Let's go ahead and uh, jump right in. I don't know if it's right the quick. coffee table because it could be one of those magic coffee tables. That like, this wasn't even at home. Know. There was no coffee table. <laughs> <laughs> oh, man. Let's go ahead and let's jump right into the PSAs, guys. You guys know what it is. Oh, my God. Off of the rails. We're tumbling down the side of a mountain right now. All right. So, Strictly yeah. Comics Auction, man. Make sure you guys are jumping over there. The affordable comic auction. In fact, they got a Paul, and he's got a pink room. He's not afraid to use it, man. So make sure you guys are going over there checking them out because it'll be happening. When we're not live, you guys are going to be over there, man, hitting that like button. If I hear you guys don't hear that, hit that like button, man. MT going to send me a message like, hey, man, they didn't do it. And guess what? We're going to send Lady B over you. She's going to drop kick the living hell out of you. And then I'll record it, and we're going to be heading over to World Star. You can be watching it there. So make sure you guys are checking it out, making it happen, man. Some awesome stuff going on. Also, Cat 60's first comic cover. 
That's all I got to say about that. All right. Let's go ahead and let's head on over to the next round. Let's go ahead and let's head on over to Maddie Freeze. What's up, man? All right. I got stupid in the last round. I found something. I was like, you know what? Let's see if people are interested. So the buyer giveaway, first off, right now, I think I have six names on there. I'll double check. Is you get the trade paperback of Winter Soldier, the buyer giveaway. Also, you will get uh, Cosmic Ghost Rider, the trade, two trades. Beep pop. But I'll give you a choice. If you really want to go crazy, I'll give you the hardcover. <laughs> Fuck that delicious Action Bronson. <laughs> there it is. Oh, God. Look, that man, is... This is no joke. This is fucking. No. What do you pay for this shit? Fucking 30 bucks. Oh, man. So you can get that if you want. So I'll give you guys the choice. You can get Fuck That's Delicious with some Action Bronson. Or you can take the two trades. So when I when, I, when the wheel goes, you guys let me know. It's there. Action Bronson. That is the best title I've ever heard in my life. Oh, it's so good. I I just love that it's like super orange. <laughs> it just looks fucking awesome. Right, dude. It's like you see that book from a mile away. Oh yeah, even on the side. The weep wop go this way. Yep. You were so. you really want to confuse people? Walk down the street with that book. Just for no reason. So. Yeah, you know, there's some good. There's some killer recipes in here. So you got Grosgan, Gron Sagan. Yeah, it's true. It's true. <laughs> got it for me for Christmas <laughs> years ago. He's <laughs> Christmas gift. <laughs> Guys, why do you take this shit, man? He's like another Christmas gift gone. <laughs> hey, but that's if they choose it. They may just be like, nah. Oh, I dude, I I imagine Chad sitting there and like, dude, you know, I spent. Two goddamn hours figuring out what the hell he wanted, and he's giving it away. God damn it. Oh, so this man. is it for the uh, $2 pull box. There's pretty much, like, I'd say about 80% of it is filled, and then it's gone forever. Well, probably for a very, 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 very long time. So $2 pull box, have at it. Uh, it's restocked, and I can't find anything else to put in there. So have at it. All right. And man. it is ready. Right off the bat, man. Uh, what will we get with that book on the coffee table? Raphael, you don't want to ask, my dude. Just saying. With this one on the coffee table? It's game over, son. Yeah, man. That's a whole lot of fun. Uh, All right, pulls. we got Rebecca with 10 pulls. There we go. One, two, three, four. Five, man, people hitting up these pulls, man. Six, seven, eight. Nine and ten. All right, let's see what's in here. Oh, that's cool. It goes to the back. To the back. Beep bop beep bop boop boop boop. Boo. To the back. Beep bop beep 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 beep. Oh, she'll like that one. And that's yeah, not bad. I mean, for two bucks, <laughs> <a> pop. <laughs> Maybe some gifts <laughs> there. It's possible. <laughs> <laughs> he's crying in the other room right Dude, now. Yeah, that's super jacked up. Chaz, he's going to make a trip into that room, man, and just show what's up. You got Marvel Knights issue number three. Probably some key that I have no idea what it is, but it was in there. Siphon. 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 Uh, issue number one. Uh, I think that's another, what was his name again? There's like a thousand of him. Titan. Hold on, hold on, hold on. <laughs> you said sci-fi for sci-fi what <laughs> okay. come on to read titan, <laughs> titan hulk there you go titan hulk there you go <laughs> uh probably some key book my brother had it in his box probably like a thousand dollars but fantastic four 359 in a newsie thing looking at then that thing. You see that? neymar the submariner in a poly bag don't know why but it's in a poly bag then issue number three of zero point Fortnite still in the poly bag has the code human fly issue number 17 classic weirdo book sleigh bells one shot bad idea where santa claus goes ham and destroys the world <laughs> fantastic four i think that's a key cover oh, in a yeah. newsie that is issue 296 anniversary cover man gun oh. honey variant uh issue number two and that was it so yeah there you go and that man. also put you on the wheel for possibility 
of a Christmas gift. Man, and... I'm just going to say, <laughs> if somebody does not take that action, Bronson, we're fighting. I'm, I'm just throwing it out there. <laughs> we're going to see. I, I, we've got to see what the community wants. <laughs> I'm giving you the option. So thank you, Rebecca, putting that over there. Bing bong. <laughs> and yeah, any other and PSK with another 10? There you go. One, two, three. Ah, oh, man. I just got to throw it out there. I love pull boxes because I get to see what you guys are getting. It's just like, holy shit, man. Look at that. It's like, uh, I don't know about you guys, but every morning before I'm about to go to work, I go fishing through my sock drawer. And I'm like, all right, man. This is like a bag of skills. Let's reach in and see what I'm going to get. I start fishing through there. And they don't match. Oh, wow. They're like, to connecting oh psk you hit you son of a bitch oh uh god damn psk <laughs> I told you he's gonna have it sooner or later and psk is probably the one so you got the oh. marvel tales classic spider-man death of captain stacy the batman three jokers book number two i don't know what that has oh has a card Whee! Zero point. Uh, I think that is not that's number two. A variant. Fred Hembeck destroys the Marvel Universe. Another kind of weird looking J1 kind of dude. <laughs> Get that number one. Transformers the foil issue number one. I don't know what that goes for, but it's in there. Then Marvel Age number 42. Don't worry, the hits are coming. Avengers. Uh, the Three Skull War issue number two. Then you got, I know you would like that. That's Dynamite issue number three. That is a Perillo variant. Bobby's. Oh, you saw a hint of what's behind this. That oh. is another Perillo. Uh, I forgot which one that is, but it's another variant that used to be crazy expensive. But you got the Stan Sakai Venom. That is a $30 book, probably more than 30 on eBay. That's a scan, Stan Sakai variant, near mint, in there. It was a $30 bin, in there, for two bucks. Yeah, man. So put that over here. That was PSK. And then I don't know no more. Okay, good. Just checking. Yeah, no, so we got some time. Out. We still got one minute, 25 seconds, you guys. You guys want to get in there on those pools? You guys see what it is. Make sure you guys are jumping in there. Yeah. Got 30 pulls. Ding yeah, nine. Nate said Nate said hi to you, Rebecca. I saw it. I seen it, man. Why well, you want to see something I really know. bad? This is me writing 10 with my left hand. What the shit is that? I had no idea. I just wrote it. I was like, uh nah, bro. Damn, but, man. Yeah, that, that looks like uh I'm gonna start doing my art lefty. It's gonna be mad. Uh-huh. Look like bad. Michael J. Fox's <laughs> autograph. It's going to be bad. So, again, uh, we got 46 seconds. Still a bunch of pulls in here. Like I said, PSK just got that for $2. Near Mint, all day, Stan Sakai. So. He said that clearly. He said, oh. <laughs> <laughs> all right. Raphael's going to do 10 pulls. Gotcha. One, two, three. Welcome to the Madhouse Beat Wad number one. You lunatic. I'm sick name. Yeah, that, that, that totally threw me. Wait, one, two, yeah, that's two, two, four, <laughs> six, seven, eight, nine, and ten. Meat Wad. That's a great name. <laughs> All right, let's see what we got in here. Oh, banger. That's at the end. Damn. All right. This was Rafael Jimenez. First, you got the 90s goodness, 64 page Avengers foil, red foil cover. Actually, in pretty good condition considering usually these are pretty beat. You got that. New Mutants number 25. I think that was a key or something with her, whatever her name was. Then Batman issue number 14, cool Two Face cover. That's actually pretty thick too. And that is in there. DC Universe, Last Will of New Testament, issue number one. Might have been a one-shot, but it's in there. Version variant of uh, Fantastic Four. No idea what number it is. I didn't want to open it up and mess it up, but version variant right there. 
X-Men issue 186, Life, Death Story, first cover of Forge. Probably has some value. I have no idea, but it was in there. Alice Ever After, I think that's issue number two. Yes, it is. Then you got, this one actually has a little bit of value. That is Symbiote Spider-Man issue number one, the, the Shaw variant. I know that one was hard to find. <laughs> this is actually, damn, you hit. Marvel Age number 38. That is bing bong. Marvel acquires Meshes of the Universe publishing license. That is a great book. And then you got a $20 book in there for $2. That was Batman 89. That is the Warren Lau. Yep, Warren Lau variant. Hell yeah, man. There. Dude, super so, dope. Yeah. I mean, Dang 10 man. bucks. I mean, not 10 bucks. That's 20 bucks total for all that. All day. Yeah, man. All you day, guys got plenty of time. That Fiefer, yeah. Fiefer, Pfeiffer? Oh. Fiefer. I like Fiefer. It's officially adopted, though. <laughs> I dig it. All right. Got that there. Look at that movie with the Fief in it. <laughs> the Fief. And again, it get, puts you on the wheel to get... No one cares about these anymore. But it was Cosmic Coast <laughs> Adventure Trade, <laughs> Winter Soldier Trade, or Fuck That's Delicious. Fuck That's Delicious. So. Fuck, that's a giveaway. So make sure you guys it are getting is. in there. All right. Well, we got Dang about 25 man. seconds left, man. You guys better get in there before it runs out. Yeah, it's about like, I would say, I'm bad at math. Let's say half a half a box left, roughly. Yeah. Is that? So, yeah. How about it? There's still bangers in there. Like I said, I already pulled out 30, 20, 20, 30s, 25s. There's still some in there. Take yeah, my man. word. Do it. All right, man. You guys are getting a whole lot of crazy books, man. And remember, Maddie's very generous with it. If he doesn't like what he pulls out for you, he's going to go ahead and give you something else. Exactly. That's why I went and grabbed this. I might get some more Christmas gifts. I'll see what else my brother got me. <laughs> oh, man. That's amazing. All right, Jersey. man. If you guys see anything you guys like, including Maddie, just hit him up and uh, let him know. All right. <laughs> hey, man. We'll see you on the next round. Appreciate All you. All right. Man. Thank you. Thank you. That's everybody who got some books. Love it. Let's go ahead and let's head on over to the Z-Man, Mr. Zarabinski. What's going on, man? Same old, same old, same old. All right. Um, this is going to be a buy it now. These two books for $400. Oh, nice. <laughs> but, of course, it comes with... <laughs> New Mutants 87, 9, 6, signed by Todd McFarlane. Holy shit. There you go. All right. I was, so, I, I was like, there has to be a catch here. What's going yeah, on, man? definitely. If they find between that, then you'd know it really is a madhouse. It was just mm -hmm. these two from 400. <laughs> <laughs> All right. I'm going to do this uh, stack right here. Starting bid, 10 bucks. We'll start going through it. Okay. Probably a lot of crap in it, but hey, whatever the stack is, 10 bucks can't go wrong. Hell yeah. First, first is Ultimate Spider Man number one, the uh, Halloween Comic Fest uh, version. Next is Hell Cop issue number two, freaky cover. Then you got a Paranormal Hitman number four. Then you got Who's Ninja Funk man? by JP. This is number two by Whatnot Publishing. Then you got the Parker Girls number one. Noctera, the Val Special, blank. Hell Cop number... Issue number one, Heart Attack, issue number four, uh, Hulk Smash Free Comic Book Day, and also a bonus preview of Marvel Avengers Assemble. Uh, the Green Llama and Black Terra, Dynamite Comics, number one. The Green Llama, man. There you yep. Go. Silver Scream. We dare you to take uh, 
This is number two. Ultraman, number one, first appearance in five. And it's number one, still in the poly bag. Cowboy Bebop, issue number two, the Netflix version. Ooh. Man, Bat. Man Bat. Battle for the Cowl. And this is a one shot Man Bat. And yes, it is a Batman uh, book. Guardians of the Galaxy, number 57. The Batman Chronicles. That's a badass cover. Ghost Rider of Vengeance Forever, number one. Big People, number one. And Sons of the Devil, I think it's number one. Oh, number 11. Oh, there you go. There you go, man. $10 start line. Make sure you guys are jumping in. You guys get a whole stack of books, man. You guys can't beat that end. You guys will get a spot on the wheel, man. He's got a whole bunch of crazy stuff coming your way. The Green Llama sounds amazing, said Nate. You know what? I think my uh, superhero name would be the Green Tamale. That's what's up, man. Yes. All right. You Stop cannot go along. $10, man. Make sure you guys are getting in there, man. There's a whole bunch of books. Yeah. This is the stack right there. And then I'll show uh, the uh, some more of the buy it nows. If you got the cash, send me a DM. I'll, I'll separate with it. Yeah, um, man. Same thing with this one. Just hit me on the DM. Spider Man is Amazing Friends, number one. Uh, let's see. Um, Department of Truth, number one, signed by Jenny Prison and a 9 6. 50 bones. I'll actually go 45 tonight. Um, 160 for uh, Amazing Spider Man, number four, first appearance of. Silk and a 9-6. Um, I don't even remember what I said on this. We'll do 70 Wolverine. Uh, volume 3, number 67, which is Old Man Logan, signed by McNibbins himself. First appearance of Spider Man's daughter. Oh, no, I can't do that one. That's my baby. There you go, man. Venom number one and a 9.8. Hey. We will do, believe it or not, 130. But for 130, it also comes with the Funko Pop, which is the exact replica of the cover. There you go. One sixty is all another copy of Amazing Spider-Man number four, with a remark by Humberto and his signature, nine point four. Thirty-five is a uh, Gwenpool holiday special number one. Uh, what else we got? No, 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 no. What's this? Oh, this is a 9-8. No. Maddie would freak out if I tried to sell that. <laughs> yeah, that's uh, pretty much it. And whatever else is on the wall, don't be afraid. I'm selling them for under FMV. Okay? No, man. So so don't be a puss. Give me a call on the DM. <laughs> there you go, man. Plenty of books to be going around, man. Make sure you guys are jumping in there. They will happen to go in the mail just for you, man. So yep. get it going. I'll gladly put them in the mail for you. Let me just put that stack back up over there. Oh, there we go. You'll make it happen. The cats are going crazy. Man. Yeah, nothing on the other walls for sale. Sorry. Otherwise, I'd show you the other wall. Hey, look, here comes a little girl running down the hallway. Go ahead. Oh. <laughs> 
she came running in as I was turning the camera. <laughs> <laughs> all right, man. Well, hey, you guys got all these books. Ten dollars, all it's going to take. So jump in there before it is too late. You guys also have the opportunity to go ahead and hit up Zarabinsky on the IGs as well. If you guys see something that you guys like. Or if you guys are watching on the Rewind, make sure you guys are hitting up the sellers, too. Information at the bottom of the screen. They will go ahead and help you out. Facilitate those books to go in your mailbox and get your way. So, all right, man. Zarabinsky, we will see you on the next round, my dude. We will Definitely. catch you then. All, all right, right, man. Deuces, my man. We'll see you. See you. Let's go ahead. Let's head it over to the great Nate. What's going on, man? All right. So, buyers giveaway for the round. Spider-Man 13. Gwen Miles, part of the Sitting in a Tree storyline. All right. So, that's the giveaway for the round. The buyers giveaway, you get to choose. Uh, you got Witchblade number one, trade paperback. You got... Demon Wars, the Demon Spirit. I think that's like a one shot. That's the whole storyline. Uh, and then you got Honor, Protect, Serve, Beat, and Burn. That's a uh, volume one. All right, so you can choose any of those if you win the buyer's giveaway. Uh, and then we're going to do a do an Iron Man builder. But first, let me go through just a few band. Uh, so you got the Hulk. Official movie adaptation signed by Bagley, 25 bucks. You got uh, the vision number one. Uh, this is a quad key, so it's the first Virginia, first Ben, and first Viv vision, and it is also the death of the Grim Reaper. Oh man, somebody needs to hit that theme song for me. X-Men Adventures number one. First more based on the uh, X-Men 92 cartoon. This book is on fire right now. This is a high grade copy. 20 bones. There you go, man. Get it while you guys can. And then this one, this is one of my favorite spec books. This is Spider-Man number one. Uh, this is the first time Peter and Miles meet. So high grade copy of that, fifteen bucks. First time Peter and Miles meet. There you go, man. And the last one, I marked this down last time I was on here. I can't go any lower, but uh, ASM fifty was it fifty one? Yeah, fifty one. Uh, first Robbie Robertson, second full. Uh, in first cover of Kingpin. I don't know what to mean by second full, but uh, second full appearance. I guess maybe he had a few cameos. Uh, in first cover of Kingpin. Low grade, though. Centerfold attached to the top staple. Uh, definitely, I would say, you know, fair range for sure. But only 50 bucks for a $50, man. ASM That's a deal. Mega Key. There you go, All man. Right. Make sure you guys are jumping in. Those are the bins, and then we're going to do a $3 builder. Every $3, I'll grab another Iron Man book. We're going to start with Iron Man 134, New Sand. There you go. So $3 builder. Let's go ahead and let's do it. All right, let me go ahead and put that up there. Make sure you guys are jumping in. A whole lot of Iron Man going to be coming in, man. $3 builder. All right. So every three dollars, a new book comes in. Starting off with this one, three dollars for the first book, Iron Man: The Challenge. Getting shot like crazy, man. Ping, 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 ping. Yep. Busting out the blickies left and right, man. That's like Batty's normal trip to the grocery store. That's what he <laughs> deals with over there in Jersey, man. All right. Yeah, man. Three dollars. So three bucks. We'll grab another one. The next one is going to be would be issue one thirty nine. Cool, cool, cool cover on this one too. This is the uh, Lady Mask. And, I mean, I don't know. You might could still win this shopping spree. I don't know that it's invalid yet. <laughs> I, th I think I heard they're bringing it back, man. You never know. <laughs> yeah, so that'll come in next. And then we got uh, issue 
159 after that versus old Ken Fang Foon. Oh, man. Or maybe that's just a double headed dragon. I think that's just a double headed dragon. That's not Ken Fang Foon. That's old Diablo conjuring dragons. Yeah, so $3 builder, man. We'll, we can build. I got plenty of Iron Man books to to pull from. So if you're trying to make a make a run or want to make a run or you want to take that leap, now is the time to do it. There you go, man. Let's go ahead and let's get that timer going. Plenty of room for you guys to go ahead and get in on this builder. Iron Man, a whole lot of it. So make sure you guys are jumping in there. It's just going to take $3 to go ahead and get it going and $3 to put in another book. That's all the way up as far as you want to go. I mean, all I personally... Yeah. All I'm personally them. afraid of heights, but I mean, you guys go up as far as you guys want. So make sure you guys are jumping up there, making it happen, man. Prove me wrong. Make sure you guys can do better than I can. What's up, Slim? How you doing, man? Slim. Yeah, we got that one. Fifty. Fifty, man. Bringing out the deals, man. So make sure you guys are jumping in and taking advantage. Get the guys. Look at that. First time Peter and Miles meet there. Fifteen. Get it while you can, bad before that price goes up. Bum, -da 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 -da. Oh, Super hot man. book right now. Does a new one come out on Wednesday? I think so, yeah. I think episode three comes out Wednesday. Damn it. Not coming fast enough. That's what she said. All right, make sure you guys are getting in there. Ooh. There. Vision for 25, man. And that one signed by Mark Bagley. There you go. $25 sign. And he's pissed. Hulk is pissed. Episode two, he's pissed. Episode three, he's even more pissed. Episode four. Still mad. And his, he ripped his pants just a little bit more, man. All right, $3 going on right now. I'm telling you, it's a builder. Jump in there. Get some Iron Man. Build it. Six will bring that one in. Nine will bring 159 in. 12 will bring in 158. Yeah, and 15, we would do 161. Iron Man and Moon Knight. And these could very well be keys i didn't go through them i picked the i got these in a collection and i just I just try to move them 173 at 18 i think i'm wondering if that cover is where that joke the tony stank came from <laughs> maybe <laughs> what's up cali 21 will bring in 190 newsstand MT wants to know what's the all in. Cut to it, man. Man, so I mean, my man, we got we have so many books, so so many. He about to do some math for you. Hold on, let him count his digits. Taking off his shoes, getting a couple extra toes in there, man, so we can count all these. Up. Thirty-two books. It's like he said, "Don't threat me with a good time, man." I know you talk about the books, not the toes, right? He said, "I'm against thirty-two books." It's like going to the fair and guessing those jellies in that jelly beans in the jar. Always way off on that, man. That's a damn scam. I don't care what anybody says. Whoever gets the right amount of books before he says it, gets them for free. <laughs> so the all-in is... <laughs> so the all-in is 125. 120 yeah 120 126 but i would do i'd do an even hundred even 100 and take them I'd all do an even an even hundred for all of them Man, 
has a fat stack of Iron Man. Yeah, and there's more books in here than that. Like there was a couple doubles, but I just threw those in. Uh, book count. So you said forty-two, right? Yeah. And then Bree plays wants to know if number one fifty is in there. The Doom Cup. Uh, I don't think one fifty is in here. No one fifty Bree plays. How you doing, by the way, Bree plays? Hope everything is good. MT says sold 100. He doesn't care how many books are in there. Just put three in there. And he's good. <laughs> you just put three in there. <laughs> oh, man. There you go, man. It's just right. so you guys know the way that I always stick by just to keep it fair for you guys. If you guys are asking questions, I am a hundred percent all on board with you guys asking questions, so you guys know exactly what is uh what you guys are getting, man. So if you guys do have that res reservation goes to the person that asks the question, then you guys can put your backup claims. It'll go by the next person that you know wants to claim, etc., cetera, etc. Cetera. So there you go, MT. Congratulations, man. Awesome stuff. So that's soul. Soul, 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 man. And you get Spider Man. There it is. Congratulations. I'm gonna go ahead and find something nice. Something very nice to go ahead and throw out there, man. Here you go, man. Congratulations. Taking home them books like crazy, man. And I mean, I did make him the thumbnail this week, so might as well. There you go, man. That is Kill a lot him. of books. <laughs> There you go. He said, uh, MT said, hang on to the modern and give it to the next buyer. MT likes the vintage. All right. I'll find you something else. How about, how about this? I got this right here. Can I can I throw this in, MT? Oh, there you go. Marble in place of it. There you go, man. MT, it's either that or he's going to send you some feet picks, man. Or both. Oh, bo hey. You never know. He said, sure, all good. All right. So we'll I don't know if that was to the boat, but yeah, we'll throw that in there. <laughs> All right. <laughs> All right, man. Congratulations, MT. Good pickup, man. And uh, my dude, Nate, awesome lot, man. Appreciate it, man. We'll I'm see sweating, you. Bro. I'm sweating. All good, man. Making we'll me do you. math on camera. Oh, dude, man. That's why I decided to uh, just draw during school. I didn't pay attention. <laughs> All right. We'll catch you on the next one, man. We'll see yeah. You Thank you so All much. Right. Let's go ahead. Let's head on over to Cat. What you got, man? Oh, my God. Some Joe Paluka. All right. Dennis the Menace and Margaret, number five. Um, these are all these are all old. I mean, um, Sad Sacks Army Life, number 52, Mickey Mouse uh, and Goofy. It's a gold key, so 704, I guess, 609. Um Daisy and Donald, um, the Beagle Boys, 407, Mickey Mouse. This is a Whitman. Um, I don't know what the issue number is on this. Um, these are Joe Palookas. These are in freaking really good shape. And these are all 10 centers. Um, 32, 39, 40, and 41. Uh, $4 each. Claim them all for 30 there you go, man. You guys got some deals up here. Get it going. And I'm gonna do a I'm gonna do a Yogi Bear um, number one um, in in high grade. Um, I'm gonna do a do an auction on this. It's a five dollar start. So as this is going, I'll I'll auction this for five bucks. All right. MT wants to bid all Joe Paluka. Hey, yo, boo, boo. There you go. Starting at five right now. There you go. Oh, I mean, do you, do you like Del Palooka? Because, I mean, we could just, I could say I got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight of them. There you go. Let them know, man, if you want them. He'll throw them at you, man. I mean, I'll just put them down. So here's uh, 44, 45. 
47 and 50. There you go. All right, guys. Make sure you guys are getting in there. Plus, you guys got the Yogi Bear starting at $5 over there to the left side. So make sure you guys are jumping in and getting in on that, man. Starting off, hit me up on those at MT. All right. So all right, here I'll make it. I'll make it a deal. There's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. Okay, so ten would be thirty. Uh, thirty-eight bucks. For all of them 11 bucks there you go all right let them know man and in the meantime i did pause the timer i want to make sure you guys are realizing that yogi bear over there to the left man get in there empty set sure he's in on it all right and then we got uh walt disney comics and stories 552 um 220 um, or Mickey Mouse 220, Donald Duck 754, Donald Duck um, 275. All right. Well, there you go, man. You guys got all of these books that are up. We got Tim Kosky going to go ahead and claim G right there, that Donald Duck playing with the knobs on the TV. That's I. Oh, yeah. He claimed that one too, anyway. So you're good. No, wait. That's D, as in dog. Put that one back. Look at the bottom row. You're going to go for the second one in the bottom row, and then you're going to go to the fourth or the fifth one in the bottom row. He wants all those. That one, that one, and that one. Yep. There you go. I'm all helping. Right. There you go. I don't know. I don't know who should. This Somebody should fight for this one. Punisher <laughs> meets Archie. <laughs> Spoiler, Archie wins. All right. Dennis the Menace in Florida, 140. Uh, Dennis the Menace, 146. 146, man. There you go. They're all up for grabs, man. Why did it, like, seriously, like, meeting Archie, that is, like, so left field, man. <laughs> Wasn't there, like, a, a Predator versus Archie that was out there? I don't, probably. I bet he kicked the hell but out of the That's fucking dope, dude. Yeah. Punisher meets Archie. Uh huh. He busts the cap at Archie. Oh, man. Make sure you guys are jumping in there, man. It's like funny. Crossover, like, you've in been those dreading. Books, yeah. In those books, they give Archie powers like, like what Longshot has, where he's just lucky. Oh. oh like, really? so, you know, like he'll, like, Punisher will pop off a sniper rifle from two miles away and it'll hit a school bus instead of him. Oh, okay. That makes it pretty good. Uh, it's not a pretty good trade off. <laughs> 11. The writing's on the bag. We got a uh, hot monster guy's going to take that Archie. He wants to see how that pans out. <laughs> what is dropping between Punisher's legs? <laughs> It's that die cut cover, bro. Yeah. Oh man. yeah, dude, I forgot this is a die cut. Yeah. It's <laughs> I remember this is a fucking die cut. Yeah, and when you open it oh, up, I'm it's like, weird. what yeah. the hell is going on? <laughs> yeah. They didn't think that one out at all. <laughs> <laughs> they shouldn't have cut this out. <laughs> I was like, what? Or maybe they, maybe they did. Yeah, they know what they were doing. <laughs> Oh my god. I legit thought that was another one of your uh you know doing doing a favor and covering things up that you know what I mean? Yeah. Alright, Tim Koski's gonna grab A, that Uncle Scrooge. Remember guys, we have a five dollar start line on the Yogi Bear over to the left. Rebecca, yeah, you're a little bit late. Book, so this is this is when Marvel started writing Yogi Bear. So Yeah, man. We're starting off with five dollars, man. Super clean. It's, Super nice. It's a nice high grade. It's got it, it's it's miswrapped, but it's still it's freaking in good shape. Yeah. All right. So there we go, right. man. Make sure you get I'm, in. I'm going into the wide wide herbs and stuff. So here's wide herb. Oh, here's wide herb. Uh, this is Adele. I don't know what number it is. Um, here's another. Here's another one. 
there. Here's another one. Here's another one. Here's another one. All Dells. Wide are there you go. All uh, Dells, all 10 centers. There you go. So Rebecca is going to claim G. And knowing you, Rebecca, if you want to claim all of them, just claim all Wyatt Earp, and we'll get that to you. Because I know you're after the Western tonight. Yep, then all Wyatt said Rebecca. She wants them all. There you go. Wyatt Earp. Here, Rebecca, I'll make you a deal. So that was uh, that was uh, one, two, three, four. I got I got five, six, seven, eight. Kid Montana, nine, <laughs> ten, and eleven. I'll do thirty bucks on the westerns. There you go. You still got $30. the D is wide arp too. Oh yeah. Oh. There you oh, go. Now you got twelve. You want that deal? Yeah. If you want it, Rebecca, it's all up to you. She said deal. There you go. Dealio. There is the end line, guys. So, so let's right. do another. Let's do another eight bucks. It'd be thirty-eight bucks for three more. There you go. Thirty-eight. Right, get you another three. Look at those, man. Ten centers. Hell yeah, man. Let them know. Another eight dollars. You get those other three too, Rebecca. So deals for you. Let them know. All right. She said, "Cool." So deal. There you go. So she's gonna take them too. All right. Okay. We'll circle back on the next <laughs> round. See you then, my man. See you, see you. All right. Let's keep it rolling, man. We got a whole nother round coming up. So let's get her going, man. Let's jump right into it. That is going to take us right on over to Mad Freeze. What you got, man? What up? All right. So uh, here we go again. We have the giveaway, which I am showing. So we have the buyer giveaway, which is the trade paperback, paperback of Winter Soldier. And the Cosmic Ghost Rider trade paperback. So you get the full story of Cosmic Ghost Rider and the full story of Winter Soldier. Then on top, if you don't want those, you can go for my Christmas present of about three years ago. That is Fuck That's Delicious in a hard... In a hard. <laughs> I, wait, remember I say hardcover, it takes me like a minute. I always get the pause. In a hardcover. <laughs> Action Bronson, Fuck That's the Delicious. If you are interested in that, let me know. I am making a wheel in the back. Uh, right now we have nine people. I did quick maths and there is 70 books left in here. So um, have at it, take whatever you want. And like, again, if you know, like if someone takes like, I don't know, just saying hypothetically, like someone takes like 10, I don't like something in there. I'm going to pull again in there. So like, there's still like room to move. So 70 total. But it could be actually 60 or less, if that makes sense, because I can give some extra books out. So, yeah. That's my spiel. Have at it. All right. There we go. $2 pull box, man. Make sure you guys are getting in there. Let's go ahead and let's wrap this box up. You guys yeah, see this is my last three? round, so there's not another round after this. So if you want them, now is the time. Do it. Do it. Yeah, and like I said, there's still some bangers in there. I did a pretty little check, and I was like, oh, yeah, that's still in there. Shit, forgot that was in there. So there you go, some man. bangers. Clear it out. Get that mystery bangers over there. and done with, man. Go ahead and find out what is going on in there, man. All right, we got and also 10 more. on a wheel. Uh, yep, yeah. Rebecca with 10. Let me grab 10. One, 10 of them, man. Two, three, four. Five, six, seven, oh. eight, nine, ten. All right. Ten books, Rebecca. Let's see. All right. Chill like that. Oh, that's a key. Oh, that's cool. Oh, put that in the back. And yeah. All right. There we go. I think that's ten. Let me just recap one more time because I'm a slow boy. One, two, three, four, five, <laughs> six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Yes. All right, Rebecca. <laughs> you got Secrets of the Haunted House. It is beat as shit, but I've always loved this cover. It kind of reminds me of Army of Darkness. Right. Kind of got. Yeah, it definitely has that feel. That is issue number twenty-five. Goes into this is Fortnite. Uh, zero points. Still in the poly bag. Got some snake eyes beating Batman's ass. 
Amazing Spider-Man Collector Corp. Still in a poly bag. That rip is on the other thing. Don't worry about it. Poly bag comic. Uh, some more bronze cool horror. Uh, that's unexpected. Issue number something. Oh, there it is. Uh, 219. <laughs> <laughs> issue something. Oh, <laughs> issue something. That was in there. Uh, oh, could nice. you see? Yeah, that's always a cool cover. Marvel Tales featuring Spider-Man. Issue number 266. Aliens, Earth War, issue number four, I think that said. Bing bong. Yes, four four with a cool alien on there. Uh, X Men, X Force number two, that is second appearance of Deadpool, I think, right? I don't know if it's that cover. Might be. I think I that know. is second appearance. Uh, that is book number four on Batman three Jokers. Does that come on a card? No card. Dead by Daylight. Issue number one, I believe that is in a poly bag too. Yep, that's in a poly bag. And then that's pretty cool. Ooh. That's uh, Shadow Man Part 2, very hard to find. That is the Halloween homage with Michael yeah, Myers cool. and, yeah, all that. So some bangers in there. That was your best one. Can she trade the alien? Yeah, 100%. Oh, you want me to grab something else, you mean? I'll grab something else. I don't care. Yeah. I'll throw alien back in there. <laughs> Let's see. We'll put the alien back in there. Bing bong. Or if you just want, I'll give it back. I'll just throw it in there for free and give it to somebody. <laughs> and you get Conan Serpent War issue number that's, one. That that's has a five dollar price tag on it. That was so, gay. There you go. Oh God, ties in here. <laughs> <laughs> so that was Rebecca. Let me write that down. Bing bong. Another 10 for Bessa. All right. And then you know, who else we got? Uh, Rafael Jimenez. Five. With five, I think? Five. Yeah. Gotcha. Five I said five dollars. One, two, three, four, and five. Let's see. Bing bong, bing. Bing, bing. Oh, okay. You hit, so you're good. You got Zero Point, issue number four, still in the poly. Moon Knight, issue number two, that's Mark Spector. Probably has some value, I have no idea. You got Bad Girls of Blackout, issue number zero. No idea what that is, but it's in there. You got, This is the best name ever. Hank Howard, Pizza Detective, Caligula's... No, in Caligula's <laughs> Safe. There is oh, so man. much going on here. That is a one shot by Bad Idea. And then uh, you got a $15 book. That was Sheena, Queen of the Jungle, number nine, the Perillo Ultraviolet. That was a $15 buy now that you just got for 10 bonuses. There you go. That in there. You have your little stack over here. Bing bong. Hey, Maddie, what if I want to pull? You are on the panel, son. You ain't get shit. I'm not on the panel. I just want you to pull this dick. <laughs> this shit is oh hard. God. <laughs> <laughs> There's a possibility of that happening in the back end. <laughs> the back end. Back end. <laughs> no, nah, I got you. Oh, hey, Ty's actually Three. alive. Breathe. What's up, man? Man, it's been a fucking month already. I bet, man. God. Zerabinski said, twist it. <laughs> Give him the old <laughs> dick twist. So we got two forty nine left. Like I said, there's pretty much I don't know. What do we, there's fifty books left, I guess, roughly yeah, around man. there. Yeah. You guys got two dollar pulls, man. Go ahead, get in there. You guys see the whole bunch of books that are coming out of there. So take the opportunity to go ahead, take advantage of Maddie, however you want to. Whether it's sure. books, or just taking advantage. Of He's giving out pulls. Yep, I am. <laughs> giveaway. I put you on a wheel. You get two trades. You get the Cosmic Ghost Rider Winter Soldier or Fuck That's Delicious. <laughs> <laughs> oh, man. Have you actually checked out the recipes in there? Like, is it actually pretty legit? The only thing I'll be honest, which I was kind of pissed about why it's up here, is like, I wanted like, I wanted fat guy food. I wanted like fucking, you know, like deep fried hot dogs and shit like that. It's all like fucking like health shit. And I was like, God damn it. Like well, cheeseburgers with Twinkie buns. That's what I wanted. Yeah, I was like, yo, <laughs> hook me up. 
<laughs> Excuse me, yeah, fri like, fried Twinkie tw buns. Twinkie well, buns is what they called Maddie like, in high school. Hard broccoli. It's like, I mean, don't get me wrong. I eat the shit out of everything in that's, here. But that's like, what we're gonna start calling you now, Maddie. You're now Twinkie buns. <laughs> <laughs> oh, get some bread. So we, we got, got five more, pulls. five more pulls. Right, that's an order. Yes. Okay, one. That is an order. Three. Hey, Rebecca, I just saw your comment. Yeah, I'm doing. I'm doing better. And let's go with this one. Five. I just let's I had a few minutes here. before bedtime, so I wanted to hop on and mess with everybody. Yeah, man. Ooh, Thank you. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> All right. Uh, I might. You know, I'm gonna grab another one in here. Let's see. Oh, okay. Good. Grab a five out book. There we go. All right, so you have zero point issue number four still in the poly bag. Marvel Age 21 with that guy on it, Void and Dingo. That's a first appearance, isn't it? I don't That's know. Void Indigo, man. <laughs> the official Marvel Index issue number six, that is a thicky boy. That's in there. Uh, I think that's a Perillo cover of Rogue, number 10, X Men. Rebecca's most hated character, Alien. David Brewer says he doesn't want Alien either. You should get the fuck. God damn it. All right. People <laughs> hate Alien. And then Everybody you guys see Naomi Season 2, Issue 1. That was a dollar bin that was in there. So let me take the Alien out. <laughs> People hate Alien. Jeez. And give you... How about Monsters Kill, Kill Squad issue number two? That is a oh. bad idea book. That is in there. So, David, a, I got you there. And I'll put Alien idea. on the side. I know everybody hates Alien, I guess. Next show, I'm doing like fucking 90 Alien books. Yeah, man. Hey, Ty, did you oh, hear we're bringing David back Brewer. the shenanigans? Do what? We're bringing back the shenanigans art prints. Oh, you are? Yeah. So, every quarter, they're coming back. Legit. Yeah. <laughs> Next time, how much it gets for me? They going in his box. He gets the aliens. There you go. All right, man. Well, hey, congratulations to everybody who uh, got some books. And uh, Maddie's pissed that nobody liked. Hey, speaking of deep fried hot dogs, Maddie. <laughs> Twinkie bun. I had to have it. Now you got Ty and Spooky. Oh, oh dude, man. that's yeah, that's a whole lot of trouble for you. All right, Maddie. We'll see you on uh, after the round. We'll see you then. All right. I'll be here. All right, man. Let's go ahead. Let's head on over to the Z-Man, Zarabinski. What's going on, my dude? I'm coming. Sorry. I was just reading the IG. Good. You good. <laughs> All right. So we did one stack before for 10, starting 10. That didn't go. So we're going to add more to it. There we go. We're going to do a stack like this. Starting 15. I'll go through it. I got to make room, people. Take his books. Dark side. Go. I mean, Jack Lecoq, what's going on, man? <laughs> Secret Invasion, three of eight. Wolverine, 41. I don't know. This book has some type of significance. I can't remember what it is. But it's in there. Uh, Black Widow Sting, number one. Lady Rawhide, number one by Tops Comics. Hey. The. Oh. Uh, Autumn. I don't know. Number one. The Autumnal. Oh, okay, the terminal. Okay, that's one that I will remember. Uh, we only find them when they're dead. Number one, Modok Head Games. Uh, number three, Maddie's Head Game. <laughs> uh, Deadpool number ten. From Deadpool to Sabretooth's Mouth. Uh, Wolverine number fifty-nine. All the other Wolverines are coming at the Wolverine. Oh, that's sweet. Yellow costume. X-Men number 249. Havoc's kicking ass. And the cover is done by Silvestri. 
Uh, Wolverine number 52. Wolverine number 54. I'm surprised Nate isn't asking if he could bid. Right? Yeah, Hot Mustard, the entire stack is at 15. Dark Wolverine number 83. Then the Astonishing X Men number 31. There you go, there, Cyclops. Hey. And then everybody's favorite cover, Alien. Yeah, that's, so, that's actually kick ass, man. If you guys don't like that, we're fist yeah. fighting. Yeah, that's way better than Maddie's. Then we got Worm World, which was a free comic book day. Oh, old and Twinkie we, Buns over there. Then we get um, Lurkers. I don't know if this is number one. Oh, it's number four by uh, IDW. Then we get Lady Rawhide and Lady Zorro, number one. First issue by Dynamite, if I'm not mistaken. Yes, Dynamite. Then we get Sabretooth and Mystique, number one. It's got a little two ticks up there. Then we got Spider-Man, uh, Miles Morales, the ultimate Spider-Man. Issue number 10, as you can see, is up against Hydra. And then we'll go back to the original pile, which is the Ultimate Spider-Man 1, the Halloween comic, Hellcop number 2, Paranormal Hitman number 4, uh, Nighthawk Nightmares, book number 6, Ninja Funk the Whatnot Publishing Exclusive number 2 of Ninja Funk. Parker Girls, number one. Noctera Val Special, blank cover. Hell Cup, number one. Heart Attack, number four. Hulk and the Agents of Smash. This was a free comic book day. If you don't remember, this is from back in the day on uh, the cartoon. It's amazing. Jetology, what's up, man? Once again, a Green Llama and Black Terror, number one, Dynamite Books. Silver Scream, number two. Ultraman, number one, first appearance in a comic. Um, still sealed in the poly bag. Cowboy Bebop, number two. Batman, the Battle for the Cow Cowl, Man Bat. This is a one shot. Done by Joe Harris and Jim Calafiore. Guardians of the Galaxy, number 57. The Batman Chronicles, featuring Batman by Bob, Back to the Future Gale, and Bill Seinbizek. Ghost Rider, number one, 50 years, Vengeance Forever. Here come the big people number one and sons of the devil number 11. damn you get all these books man hot mustard in at 40 dollars right now time is ticket so you guys better start throwing out some numbers before it is too late hot mustard in at 40 plus you guys also got those i'm just gonna hold them like this there you go i'm able to rest my arms here and hold them in place yeah it's my stack we have 41 from Rebecca Raider. You guys also do have those $200 uh, mystery boxes as well, so make sure you guys are getting in there. If you guys want to get on those, come with some slabs and a whole bunch of other good stuff too, man. So make and for shits happen. and giggles, someone give me a number one through five. We already saw one box. Hopefully they don't pick out the same box because I did mix them up. There you go. So Just to show you guys what's in it because this is the last round, so you'll have to One through five, guys. Jump them crazy mystery boxes. If you guys are interested, all you guys got to do is just jump in. And if you guys need to work with him, man, like, hey, he'll work with you. All you guys got to do is just like, hey, man, I get paid on this day. Can I do this? Can I do that? Like, he's really easy to work with, man. Just talk to him. Just let me know. I want to see box number two. I'm watching your mystery boxes. Becky, they are 200 bones, but they have two slabs in them. Um, if you're interested in knowing what the slabs are, if you look at my GI 
pretty much showed the slabs I was putting in. And they got a stack of rolls in them like that. Some of them come with prints that look like that look like this, which are signed by Joe Rubenstein. Uh, you already have this print, so I know you bought it from me before. But they come with prints in there. Don't be afraid, anybody. Like I said, pick a number, and I'll, I'll show you what's in one of the boxes. You don't have to even buy it. Nate said two. I'm feeling two as well. Let's see what... Uh, let's Number see what two? Let's see. So, let me see. We'll reach over here. We'll grab the second one, which is number 10. Oh, no. Number 20. <laughs> is that a box that Maddie sent you? Because that looks like Maddie's brother. <laughs> yeah, she, she... No, my, my daughter did that. So, oh, what do you know? I'll throw in a different print if, if she picks this up. But this is what was in there. Um, Rubenstein, watercolor, signed by Rubenstein. It's nice. We'll go through the rows first. Oh, my God, there's quite a lot of them in here. I just kept tossing them in randomly all through the night. You pull out the rows, throw them there. There's some more rows back here. And we'll grab these two slabs, throw them right there. Is there another row on there? Oh shit, there is. Oh wow, it's a signed row. All right, let me grab these. So these are the rows that would be in there, which would be uh, the signed book, uh, Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles. I forget the issue; it's significant supposedly, and it's signed. Who's it signed by? Is that a Bjorn cover? I believe so. That's nice, man. No, that looks like Randy Brown. Randy G. Uh, Ryan G. Brown. Ryan G. Brown. Yeah, okay. I think that's Brown, yeah. Then um, Dark Hawk, number 25. Oh, classic. Uh, limited print, of course. Wow, look at that, man. Uh, it's a comic, but it's limited, limited uh, yeah. run. Um, another one of those stores. Spider Punk, number two. Dark Hawk number 18. Daredevil 2, 72. Green Lantern number 132. Nick Fury, Agents of S.H.I.E.L.D. number 5. The Punisher Initiate, War Journal. G.I. Joe, Special Missions number 10. Marvel Universe number 8. Spider-Man, Tangle Web, We Weave, Dark Hawk, number two, uh, Avengers West Coast, number 15, John Byrne cover, if I'm not mistaken, yes it is, John Byrne, uh, New Avengers, number seven, uh, Pretty Deadly, and then Power Man and Iron Fist, and then I'll show you the two slabs that were in there as well. That would be the Strike Force number one, Ash Can. Ooh. And. Oh! The X Men Adventures in the 96. That's there you go. One. That's what would have been in there. There you go, $200. Oh, if you guys are yeah. interested, you better get it while the getting's good. And he's got all the other mystery boxes. All you guys got to do $200 for a mystery box. And if you guys got to work out a plan, a payment plan, you guys can go ahead and do so. Zerabinsky will help you out, hook you up, make sure you guys are in and out of the door, getting some of that in the mail, making it happen. So make sure you guys are jumping in there and getting it going, man. And the art print, you guys cannot beat yeah. that. God, man, there's a whole lot of bang for your buck if you guys are jumping in there. I don't know where else you're going to be able to find that. It is Don Cheetah. In fact, huh? <laughs> Ty Salazar's uh, avatar is Don Cheetah. What's it, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> All, All right. right, so who won the stack again? That Rebecca? is going to Rebecca for 41. Well, <laughs> she just filled up that short box. There you go. Okay, Rebecca. Right. It's yours. There you go. Hey. Congratulations. Rebecca Raider. My, <laughs> the, the avatar is Don Cheadle, but the, the name is Maddie's Dominatrix. Oh, there you go. <laughs> That makes a lot for of old, sense. For old Twinkie Buns over there. And uh, 
I have um two people for the uh the the buyer incentive. Don't worry, I'm gonna throw uh books in each for the buyer incentive. There you go. Buyer incentive on IG to show you show what you got. All right. Awesome stuff, man. All right, Tara Bisky, appreciate you, man. We'll see you on the after the round. All right. Let's go ahead. Let's head on over to Nate. What's going on, man? What you got, my dude? All right, so let's do the round giveaway. I'll let, I'll let whoever wins choose. You can have the Spider-Man 13 uh, or the Old Man Logan number one. There you go. So that's the giveaway for the round. All right. <laughs> You choose whichever one you want, and then the buyer's giveaway is show this, but uh, we'll do it one more time. Just make sure everybody sees uh, the Witch Blade number one trade, uh, Demon Wars, the Demon Spirit trade, and Honor, Protect, Serve, Beat, and Burn. This is number one. So any of those trades to... Whoever wins the wheel will be able to do uh, shoes. Uh, so let's show some bins, and then I'm actually going to do a Fantastic Four builder. Okay, so let me show this one first. So this was in the uh, DC Comics Presents uh, Winner's Choice that I have. I have an extra one. So if anybody else wants an issue 43, I'll do it for six bucks since that's what the Winner's Choice was earlier. So that's DC Comics presents 43 in a newsstand. I'll do that one for six dollars. If anybody wants that, there you go, six bucks. Had, had an extra, and I know Cat was doing some cartoon books earlier, so I had some of those too, man. So I'll do the same thing. And I'll do four bucks a piece. Uh, so this is Donald Duck Adventures one two three. So I'll do all these for. 12 bucks and these are high grade these are like near mint which is insane yeah, it's unusual to get those kind of books in near mint yeah. Hell yeah so i'll do 12 for all three of those uh and then i'll do these at uh you were doing what four bucks a piece cat is that right yeah all right so i'll do these for four a piece yeah we'll just we'll do that uh, so you got Casper and Wendy, uh, the old Harvey comics. This is number one, actually. Probably should have looked that up before I said that. <laughs> uh, Damn. Uh, you got <laughs> Sam and Bugs Bunny, Gold Key. Uh, Life with Archie. So this is issue number 193. This is when Fawcett Comics was printing it. Uh, but this is like a rare Archie bonnet cover. You don't really see those. So, tied up on the field. So four bucks on that one. Uh, Casper and the Ghostly Trio, number four. We'll do that one. Four bucks. Uh, so this Woody Woodpecker, I had ten bucks on it because it's like high grade, which is, again, crazy for a Dell book. But I'll do the four bucks on it uh, but that's woody woodpecker oh man i agree what and, was that casper book uh so i had two casper the number one uh casper uh and wendy the good little witch number one uh and then i had tarzan uh, weird, weird worlds, uh, another bondage cover, twenty center. I think that uh, Rebecca wanted to bend all of your four dollar vintage books. One, two, three, four, five, six. That's twenty four <laughs> bucks for all of them. There you go. Oh, did you want the Donald Duck too? Uh, you can do the Donald Duck too. That was 24. That'd be 36 for the three Donald Duck adventures as well. Yep, been all six. Okay, gotcha. You got it. Okay. Now, um, 
Uh, we'll do a Fantastic Four Builder, uh, like we did before. These are these are mixed up. So these aren't gonna work, but uh, three dollars. And every three dollars, I'll grab another book. So all right, we'll start with two thirty six newsstand. This is a Stanley Jack Kirby is in this one. Uh, John Byrne cover. Uh, so that's what we'll start with. We'll start with that one for three bucks, and then we'll build it up. There you go, man. We can build. We can make it better. Make sure you guys are jumping into their three dollars. We'll go ahead and start. You guys want to add some more books? So every three dollars will do just that. So let's go ahead. Let's get it going. We do got time on the clock, man. Yeah, and these are all VF or better range. If one, if there's one that's not, I'll let you know. Uh, the next one is a. 323 newsstands. You got a got Kang on the cover there. Orphan Storm. So you bring that in next. Nine, 342. Direct. Spider Man. It's when Spider Man was in every Marvel book for about six months. Uh, 335. Direct. 340. Let me just see. Let me just figure out what the all in is and save us some time. Just in you case. You can do some math. Six, nine, 12, 15, 18, 18, 18, 18, 18, 18, 18, 18, 18, 18, 18, 18, 18, 18, 18, 18, 18, 18, 18, so we'll do a builder, but, or we can do the stack for 30. That's a TVA key there. I didn't know that. Awesome doom cover. Wild thing on there. That's a key as well. It's Return to Jean Grey and Phoenix. Uh, X Factor key as well. New stand. The annual. I think this is a key too, but I do not recall what it is. Uh, 340, 323, I think, 335. Spider-Man appearance, 342. Kang on the cover there with uh, Mantis. And then the uh, John Byrne cover with uh, Stan Lee and Jack Kirby on the interiors. So all those for 30, or we can do this one for three, and we can add from there, however you guys want to do it. There you go. All in at 30. And if you guys want to keep on building, it's three to start off. And if you guys want to add another to it, it's every $3 brings in another book. So we got a minute and 42 seconds on the clock. Plenty of time for Mind you guys to go ahead. Get in there. Do it. Plenty of time for you guys to go ahead, jump in, make it happen. All these books. Oh, while we're... While we're waiting, which which uh, giveaway did you want, Becky? The Old Man Logan or the Spider Man? Since you got the cartoon book earlier, you, you can pick choose. your pick. Choose whichever one you want. Just let me know, and I will add it to your stack there. Like I say, three dollars start. We'll start with this one, or thirty, and you get eleven Fantastic Four books. Right, man. So we're starting off with three dollars. It is a builder, so every three dollars you go ahead, you put in, we'll add another book. If you guys want the all in and just want to take them all home, you guys got plenty of great books in here. A lot of value, bang for your bucks. So make sure you guys are jumping in there. It is thirty dollars. You want to take them all home? So go ahead, get in there. Right now, right now. Meow. What meow? Yep, three dollar builder or thirty all in, and you get basically you get one of the books for free. But that's it's pretty cheap for these, actually. Yeah, man, you get it before uh, you know they offered me a costume of Fantastic Four. They're about to call it the Phenomenal Five, and I was like, Nah, man, I'm good. Yeah, well, I mean, you know, they've been casting the movie, and I'm super curious how that's going to go. I just. I just want them to pick up the pace, man. I really want to start off with the uh, Deadpool movie, man. 
And I'm telling you the truth, man. I I'm literally like I need myself another X Men cartoon. That ending, by the way, is that that's the same way the old one used to end, right? The outro credits with yeah, them kind yeah, of yeah. spinning in 3D. Okay, I was trying to remember. Like, is that how it was? Like back when? I know. All right, man. I'm excited for Deadpool, but I'm not as thrilled for the Fantastic Four movie. Yeah, we'll see how it goes, man. All right, end line is coming in. I think this weekend I'm gonna go see that uh, Godzilla and Kong with my uh, my nephews. Take them to go see it. 4D, man. It's gonna be like a 4D, you know, the movie theater. Man. Yeah, 4D, not 3D. There's four Ds. So you're like throwing Kong hair in your face while you're watching. Yeah, the movie. dude, and being thrown out of my seat and shit. So yeah, it's all worth it. Godzilla right, breathing fire across the screen, and they turn the heat up in the place. Yep, smell a vision. Wow, it's the future. It smells like. Gorilla ass in here. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. <laughs> All right, Jesus, Nate. Man. Appreciate you, man. Jesus, yeah. man. <laughs> Bing bong. Bing bong. Uh, <laughs> Stick around, man. We're going to run the run the wheel. And Becky, let me know which one you want. Otherwise, I'll just uh, I'll pick one for you. You got Spider-Man <laughs> or Old Man Logan number one. But you get to choose which one you want for free. That's, that's, those are yours. Oh, free. Yeah, Spooky, they're going to, all the people working at the movie theater, be walking around the front row with buckets, <laughs> tossing at people. Yeah. That's going to be horrible. <laughs> all right, man. We'll see you on the farewells and for the wheel, my man. We'll catch yeah. you then. Let's go yeah. ahead. Let's head on over to El Gato 60. Let's go. All right, there's nothing here. Well. Five dollars. <laughs> Buying air. Yeah, five dollars. <laughs> All right. I'm telling you right now, these are. I, I shouldn't be doing this because these are not freaking five dollar books. Ghost Rider eighty. Seventy nine. Oh crap. 77. You guys better be buying these, man. $5 claims. Um, 71. I mean, these are like $8 and $10 books. God. I got you, Miss Becky. Sixty-seven. Sixty. 59, 56, 54. Oh, no, I hear you, Rebecca. I hear you. But all right, guys, $5 claims on the board. I'm just waiting for the claim all. Someone's got to do it. Dude, this is a, like, God. Damn, man! If you guys are out there you, looking to, I'm telling you right now, there's gonna there's three racks of these. Um, so this is the first rack. Uh, for forty bucks, one hundred twenty bucks, you get them all. Hundred and twenty. Damn, that's a deal, man! All this Ghost Rider ready to go, man. If you guys are looking to get your collection going, this is the place to start it. Make sure you guys are jumping in there. Get yourself some of that Ghost Rider. Dude walks around. Like he's a badass, then hops on a motorcycle. And he thinks he's even more badass. Telling you, man, his head's on fire. Can't beat it. Dude wears leather skinnies. Then kicks ass doing it. Make sure you guys are jumping in there. I'll Plenty do, of I'll, room. I'll do one more rack. So there's 53, 57, 51, 54, 49. Uh, 48, uh, 47, 46, 45, and 44. I'm not putting the other ones up unless, unless I get, unless I get, uh, a little action on these. Yeah, you guys better get moving on that, man. There's plenty of books up there, man. And you guys see up at the top right corner, when a Toys R Us shopping spree telling you man make sure you guys are getting it going making it happen plenty of opportunity to go ahead jump in there get something nice all right man don't be sleeping go ahead get it make it happen 
the next the next uh set of these there's like fifteen dollar books in there. There you go, man. But we could sit here and look at them. They're pretty. <laughs> <laughs> oh man, we still got a minute and fifty-two seconds on the clock. Plenty of time for you guys to go ahead and jump in here. All these books. I'm telling you. They need a home, man. This is a hell of a deal. Five dollar claims, man. You claim all of them for forty dollars. I mean, you guys literally resellers, anybody out there, you guys could easily double these books. No problem. So go ahead, get in there, especially the full collection, man. You guys wanted to sell this as an entire lot. You guys pick up all three of them. Under oh yeah, do it's, the like, math, it's like freaking two hundred and uh it's or uh three hundred and eighty dollars in books. Yep. Nope. So you make a small investment, turn around, flip it, cat 60, making the deals for you guys. So you guys have that margin to go ahead and get in return. Go ahead, jump in, get some of that Ghost Rider, man. Do it. Or if this is for PC, man, this is a hell of a place to pick it up. I don't know where else you're going to be able to find all of these books at this price. You guys are looking to go ahead and get it, man. Time is ticking. It won't be here forever, man. You guys got about another 50 seconds to go up. Go ahead, make up your mind. Think about it. Don't think too hard. Go ahead and jump in on it, man. That's how decisions are made. People jump into the pool, man. They find out halfway down, there ain't no damn water in it. Oh, well, that's what you do, man. You just go ahead and you just do it. You figure it out, man. Right? We got about 30 seconds on the clock. Time is ticking before that end line will hit. And I don't want to hear you crying, but I want to see it. You start crying, man. Send that to us. I want to laugh a little bit. Make it happen. Time be ticking, man. Time keeps on ticking, ticking. Damn, dude. Now it's going to get... <laughs> oh, damn it. That's going to be all day at work tomorrow. It's going to be great. God! <laughs> man. All right, man. Make sure you guys are getting in there. Making it happen. End line coming in. And if you guys... Are interested in these books and get in the DMs, hit up Cat 60, make it happen. Let them know what is good. All right, man. We will circle back. Let me go ahead and uh get these farewells going real quick. Let's go ahead and uh let's make it happen, guys. You guys, we've had a full night, Monday night, man. Got the week going, getting it started. But I do want to go ahead and get some shout outs on my behalf real quick before we go ahead and dive into the wheels and everything. So I uh, just want to give everyone a big shout out for tonight. You guys are all awesome. Uh, you guys, honestly, super fun to go ahead and hang out with everybody. Really do appreciate all you guys. Man, every time that we get everything going and we get things rolling on the week, man, it gets my motivation, gets my gears going to go ahead and hop into the next auction and all that good stuff. But, hey, make sure that in between the Madhouse, you guys are hopping over there to the Strictly Comics group, man. You guys will find a bunch of our Madhouseians over there, and you guys will find... A whole lot of Paul. I'm telling you, man. You guys want to get some nonsense on the side, man? The dude's a lunatic in his own right. Too damn crazy to even be in the madhouse. We couldn't keep him contained. Dude just went off the walls and painted his walls pink. So, it happens. But make sure you guys are jumping over there and showing some love, man. Also, if you guys are interested, join on the Patreon. And you guys get a whole lot of incentives, including the uh, quarterly shenanigans art print that we will be doing. The original artwork done by myself and Batty will be also helping out with some of that artwork as well in the future. So make sure you guys are jumping in. You guys will get that every quarter. We are going to go ahead and give our patrons something back in return, including a one of one rare chase. Someone's going to have a chance to get it, man. And you guys also get one spot on the wheel. If you guys are on the YouTube channel members, if you guys are on the second tier of the channel memberships, we'll go ahead and give you a spot on that as well. So make sure you guys are jumping in, man. A whole lot of cool stuff coming in. We're, doing, we're making some changes and make things a little bit more crazy around here. So stay tuned, man. We do appreciate every single one of you. Let's go ahead and let's head on over to the farewell. Start off with Matt Freeze. What you got, man? Wait, first off, again, if no one's paid attention, how wait, it goes the opposite. Wait, no. Wee. How sick is the animated background? Check that shit out. Now it's nothing there. There it is. Look at that. So what? that's how Vatican's work yesterday. Insane. But again, uh, I got my wheel ready uh, for the buyer giveaway, so I will share that. Let's see if I do that correctly. Share, Scron. <laughs> oh, Maddie, you're doing this. You fucked it up. 
Oh my god. <laughs> so I got it all set up. I got PSK three times, Doc Cobb, Teresa twice, David Brewer I twice, Rebecca twice, uh Raphael twice, and I think that's it. So everybody should be there correctly. I double checked it. So I'm just gonna shuffle it a couple times. Bing 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 bing. Good luck everybody, and here we go. There you go. Let's see what it's gonna be. Rebecca taking it down. There you go. Awesome so Rebecca, stuff. If you're still in chat, uh, I don't know which one you're going to take, to be honest. So you got the option of the two trade paperbacks. That's Cosmic Ghost Rider and Winter Soldier. Both are trade paperbacks. And then, How bizarre. <laughs> How bizarre. <laughs> and then you got Fuck That's Delicious, Action Bronson, the cookbook. So let me know which ones you want, either orange or trades, and they will be coming to you. And uh, yeah, that's pretty much it. Uh, I'll be back on uh, Wednesday. Uh, I won't be doing the pull box. I actually got books this time, so I was just waiting for them to come in the mail. They should be here tomorrow. So uh, I got some books coming Wednesday, so come check us out again. We will be live. I got more titty topless books, so you're going to want to be here on Wednesday. So. Hey, did we ever figure out uh, James's last name? He wrote it in chat. Uh, I forgot. Is it Paul I, Mictor? I think it was. I'm pretty sure it was. I, I always jack it up. I'm not going to try. Hold on. Paul Mictor. Give it a shot. Paul Mictor. Paul Mictor. There you go. Yes. Yeah. I got it. <laughs> yes. Yeah. Yeah. cat. All right. So again, uh, yeah, that's just my outro. So yeah, uh, uh, Rebecca, I'll hit you up on IG, and uh, everybody else who bought from me tonight, I'll hit you up on IG, give you totals, and that's it. So I'm done. Bye. All right. She said she wants the cookbook, Maddie. Gotcha. Yeah, it, it was in the YouTube side. The so there you go. All right, there you go, man. Fuck, that's delicious. There you go. Congratulations <laughs> to you, Rebecca. We're best friends because you picked that book. All right. Well, hey. Let's uh, head on over to the man himself, Zarabinsky. What's up? What's up, dude? Don't tell him. Don't tell him. Purchasing all that good stuff here on Madhouse Comics. As you can tell, I'm extremely freaking tired. I've been tired the whole night. I struggled through. Uh, Becky and Lackey, uh, you both getting free shit in your boxes. Uh, Becky, you now have officially a full short box, so you know I'll be dropping that in the mail. Um, I'll hit you guys with totals later. Becky, your shipping's covered already because you paid for shipping before. Lackey, your shipping's not covered, but it's probably only going to be 10 bones. Um, other than that, everybody stay safe. Don't forget Mondays, Wednesdays, Fridays, Madhouse, Comics, and Collectibles. Tell your friends, tell your neighbors, tell the people you hate to watch. Madhouse Comics and Collectibles. Tell your grandma, too. She might like comics. Yeah. Yeah, we need more grandmas <laughs> in here. Yeah, man. All right. That's what's up, man. Well, hey, Sarah Bisky, you're the man, dude. Appreciate you. Uh, you know, I know it's been a busy day for you, man, and always coming through, man. I do want to, you know, throw kudos to you, man. Every All the effort and everything that you go through, man, to go ahead and do what you do, man. Appreciate it, man. So you the man. Don't care what anybody else says because they're saying the same thing. So only my opinion matters. All right, man. Well, hey, All good. we'll see. All good. We'll see you on the next one, man. Appreciate right. you. Let's go ahead and head on over to Nate and his big black couch. What's up, man? Hey, hey, hey. Yeah, man. I'm worn out too, but I do appreciate everybody coming in and hanging out. I had such a good time, like I always do. Um, I'm not sure if I'm going to be back next week or not. I'm kind of just filling in the word short panelists. So. I might be back next week. I might not be. We'll see. But I will yeah. be back eventually, for sure. You never um, know, man. The giveaway, like I said, the buyer's giveaway, you get to choose between the, uh, these trades here. So you got Witchblade Volume 1, right? starting the story off. Demon Wars, the Demon Spirit. It's a one-shot. And this guy's a very well-known fantasy <laughs> author used from a movie producer uh no it's not i actually designed, oh, I designed that set oh. myself. 
Couch call. <laughs> Uh, and then we got honor, protect, serve, beat, and burn. Number one, it's about cops. This one's wild, dude. I'll show you guys like a little bit. Like I'm not trying to steer you one way or another, but like, oh, but it looks interesting. I've never even heard of that title. Inside like... of this one is pretty crazy. Uh, look at that prison. Prison. Prison, prison, prison sex. What's this chapter? In Jersey. Uh, that's Nate Nate oh, calls that Tuesday. That. that book looks that look like it should be in the back end. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. That's a back end book for sure. There was nothing in there that we can't show on YouTube, so everybody don't don't freak out. So there you go. All right, let's it's, go ahead. Let's get that it's wheel up. Fucking here. art. Yeah, yeah man. It's I art. That to YouTube. I'm, I'm the same damn. Yeah, that's the thing, Becky. You can show naked guy butts all day long. Yeah, man. All right, here we go. So we're going to spin it on the wheel. We do have a whole lot of Becky, some mustard. So Becky with some mustard, some southern, and some empty. Some southern mustard, if you will. See what I did there? Let's go ahead and let's shuffle that up. Let's see what we do again. Dijon mustard. Man, I miss seeing Gambit on TV, man. But Rogue didn't didn't dirt. Empty! It is MT is the winner. There you go, man. Uh, so I don't know if MT is still hanging out. Um, if he's not, he can he can choose if he is. Uh, and if he's not, I'll send him a message on Instagram and let him know he won. That he can choose. There you go. You take your pickings, man. So you got some Demon War, some of that Witchblade, some of that Honor. Yeah, this thing is wild. Just send him dude. a Scotty Young book. He'll be fucking related. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> That's his favorite. Oh, man. You told I know. Me. Like, I, I I would, like, this one I think is good. It's really, really good. Like, you're into, like, Game of Thrones style fantasy. He likes all the old books. Just find some dust and put it in his really zip good. Yeah, Really, man. really good. So, I'll let him know. Once well, the all right, man. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Rebecca knows what he wants. Yeah. All right, my dude. I'll, I'll appreciate you. you. We'll see you on the next one, my man. Yep. Let's go ahead, you, everybody. Let's head on over to Cat Sixty. What's good? So, so unfortunately, there are a lot of people not going to get laid, um, but one lucky person <laughs> is because they bought the X Men books. I'm sure he's on the phone right now saying, "Hey, look, Cat's gonna ship me out tomorrow." I'm going to probably get it in three days. So he's planning his weekend. He's he's trying to find a coffee table. Nobody else is getting late. Just that guy. Oh, man. <laughs> These are my giveaway. It's not a choice. You get both of them. Oh, look, there you go. Look at this fucking thing. Dude, that's a weapon. Yeah, that's God. serious. That's a war crime, man. I don't... <laughs> God damn! Look at that, man. You get that's a thirty-five dollar book. Yeah. So there you go. All right, let's see what's gonna happen, man. All right, we got it up there. So we got Tony, MT, Rebecca, Evan, Tim, Ryan, PSK, Amy, and Doc. I, I like Doc how Doc is like screaming. Yep. <laughs> yep, you have to. Yeah. All right, man. Here we go. If I ever see Doc Cop in public, I'm just screaming the entire conversation. All right, here we go. How what bizarre. is it? Albazar. It's going to be stuck in your head, dude. Damn, MT going with a double header. <laughs> Respin. 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 All right. <laughs> no, it's not fair. <laughs> MT won it. <laughs> MT taking it home. Let's see. It's Ryan. MT's taking it home. There you go, man. All right. Congrats to you, Ryan. You the man. No, MT, dude. He fucking won. <laughs> I was fucking around. <coughs> nah, I don't care. Whatever you want to do. Yes, yeah, so he was the one that won. I don't. You got, dude. I take you guys seriously, man. So I'm just telling you. So two out of three. Yeah, right, James. <laughs> <laughs> That's two. No, out man. Of three. Hey, so you guys, you guys know that we got giveaways every night for you guys. Just pick stuff up from the sellers, man, and just for uh, hopping on and buying some stuff, man. You get some stuff in return, man. Have some fun with it. So all right. Well, hey, man. Thank what you. What you guys say to the people? That's it. Thank you. Good night. All right. Awesome La Pasta. All right. There we go. 
Unless you're <laughs> unless you're unless you're OG. If you're OG. <laughs> <laughs> oh man. The stinky pink. All right. Well, hey guys. Fun night tonight, man. Appreciate every single one of you guys. Make sure you guys are checking out. Uh, if you guys are interested, I, I really do mean it. I am going to uh, have a whole lot of stuff that we are working on in the background. Um, we're currently we're rolling everything out. As you can see the backgrounds, everything. Everything's being updated little by little. Um, making strides to make sure that the Madhouse is a little bit more crazier for you guys every time you guys come back. Uh, but also, man, check out the Patreon. We got those uh, quarterly prints that are going to be coming out. And you have an opportunity to go ahead and get a one-of-one one chase, which will include some metallic printing, all that stuff to it, the whole works. So if you guys are interested, check out the Patreon. That is uh, www.patreon.com. That's Madhouse Comics. Uh, the link is in the description of the video. Also, check out the memberships. You guys can get a spot on the wheel that way. If you guys want a little bit of swag in the chat at the same time, every Super Chat is going to go ahead at the end of the month and go ahead and get you guys an entry on the wheel for some swag from the Madhouse store. On top of that, next show, this Wednesday, we're going to go ahead and have up two wheels at the end of the show for you guys. I owe you guys for the giveaway for the month before and for this month. This will be the last time that we do the old tradition of the way that we did giveaways. And we're going to go start with a, a clean lapse of doing a full month of uh, the giveaways the way we normally do them. So stay tuned for it. See you guys on Wednesday. Take it easy. And uh, make sure you guys pick up Kat's first cover appearance because it's awesome. So go do it. All right. Deuces, my guys.